Hello. Welcome. Welcome. It's fun. Look at the fun we're having. Look at the fun we're having. It's fun. Look at the fun. Okay, welcome. Hello. Hello. Hello, everybody. Hello. Hello. How you doing? Look at the fun we're having. Okay. So today is going to be a very special little stream uh, because I... Okay, so as you know... I've played through Zelda Breath of the Wild on the streams before. We finished the whole game, uh, and we, we did everything. We we finished the game, we played it all the way through. We beat yeah! Thanos, I was gonna say, Ganondorf. Thanosdorf? Thanondorf. Mama Corpse, thank you for the nine months. But, we finished the game, and obviously, okay, so I want to preface this by saying, obviously, I own the base game. I have... I own the game. We can all attest to the fact that I own the game. Okay, good. Because this is emulated. This is running on my computer, uh, not on the actual Switch. So uh, it's a little bit of a gray area, but but because I own the game, I feel like we, we could be okay with that. <laughs> Maybe. Because, and this is, to me, this is kind of mind-blowing. Because they've managed people in general the modding community i guess as a, as a whole have managed to get the game not only running on a computer but at an unlocked frame rate which is bizarre because the base game the real game for the switch is locked to 30 fps which means that the whole engine the whole everything to do with physics and shadows and lights and and all the AI pathing, every calculation in the game is locked to a 30 FPS uh, frame rate cap. You cannot run the game at any other speed. But they've done that. So now you can unlock the frame rate. I've set my frame rate to target 60 FPS. We'll see, maybe my computer probably... I was doing some tests earlier and just running around in the world... And I don't know if my computer is gonna hit 60 FPS at all times. I think it was it was it was sort of bouncing between 40 and 60 FPS, but it's still way above 30 already. Not only that, instead of running the game at a 720p resolution, or if you dock the switch, you I think it's 900p. Instead of that, I'm now playing the game at 2K. You can play it up to 4K resolution based on your hardware and your computer. Um, but you can basically just bump the resolution not so. This is now, because my monitor is 2560, 1440. So I'm running the game at that resolution. So there should be no... Well, to you, because it's a, it's a live stream, there would be downscaling, uh, obviously. I'm also recording this for YouTube later on. So the the... The visuals, if you're watching this back on YouTube, should be better than they are on the actual stream, obviously. But, not only that, but they've also added a first-person mod. So I'm going to start a new game, because obviously I don't have my old save files. So I'm going to start a new game, and then I'm going to uh, explain a little bit more when we get into it, because it's weird, and it's awesome. So let's just start over. Let's just start a new adventure. Uh, I'm not going to play the whole thing again. I'm just going to get into it. And I kind of want to play up until I get the glider and we can maybe explore the world a bit. Potentially get to... I want to get to the Korok Forest and I want to see the Master Sword and basically sightsee. I have also enabled two cheats. There are cheats that you can just click a checkbox. Uh, I have enabled infinite health and infinite stamina. So we should be able to just explore, sort of, really. It's That's my fun. goal, anyway. It is fun! Look at the fun we're having. <laughs> Thanks, Astrid. <laughs> Thank you for the two months. So, yeah, let's just do Let's just try it. There, I, I'm also going to preface uh, by saying that there's probably going to be some stuttering and some lag when it's loading things, because it is an emulation, so it's not going to be a perfect one-to-one. Oh, -one. Yeah. If you want to play a perfect representation of the game, obviously play the original game on the original hardware. But, look at this! Look at how crisp and how clear it is! It's amazing! Dude, it looks amazing. It looks so... This is... I like Nintendo, please. Thanks, Jack. Just release your games on computers. Blue Purple 100 Bonus 10, would you try the new VR mode for this game on the Switch? I'm thinking about it, but... 
maybe, but I don't really want to get a Nintendo Labia just to do the VR mode because it kind of looks kind of kind of kind of crappy, doesn't it? Maybe if they implement it in this version and for the HTC Vive, yes. But anyway, check this out. Now, Oh, she's going to talk first, isn't she? No. Oh yeah, it's this whole bit. <sighs> Nintendo what now? Oh yeah, the the thing, right? Look at this. It just zooms in. I'm a first person man. It's so cool. So, I'm going to get out of here and then I'll explain how the first person mode works. But it's pretty sweet. It's very, 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 very smartly done. And to the people who did this, I applaud you because that you are geniuses. Take it. It will help guide you after your long slumber. Hell yeah. Also, there's only English, so I can't put it to Japanese, sadly. <laughs> but we can live with that. It looks so good. Just wait until we get outside, yo. The Sheikah Slate is a mysterious tablet glowing center you've never seen this device before, or have you? Mike, you know this. You've been through this. Is this the Mike we know, though? Oh, also, I think this is a, this is a, a kind of an interesting side effect, is when... You can see it sometimes when the camera angles switches uh, perspective. You can see a frame of blur. And I think that's because the camera is uh, trying to switch between frames at a 30 FPS frame rate. But since I'm running it higher than 30 FPS, there's a frame in between the frames where the camera shows its moving position. So there's a lot of little things like that. It's like, okay, I, I get it. But look at this. Dude, we can see the ceiling in here now. We've never seen ceilings before in this game. It's pretty sweet. It's super cool. Okay, trousers? Yeah, I'm gonna put on some trousers. Hell yeah. Ah, <sighs> man. It's such a... It's like a Skyrim. It's fun. It is. Look at the fun we're having. I'm doing my best. This is cool. Thanks, Morga... Mo more Morgan Ace, I'm gonna say. Or Morgana Say. No, Morgan Ace seems better. Oh wait! Nintendo controls, they're reversed. There you go. I've I've not played the game like this, so I haven't seen anything other than like right outside the door. So that's gonna be all new to me as well. But man, if you could mod in, I guess technically you could. Dude, you could totally play this with a mouse and keyboard as well. Because it's emulated, you set up your own input. So you can just, instead of using, because I'm using an Xbox controller to play this now. But you could totally do it with a mouse and keyboard. If you just configure it, the emulator that way. Dude, weird. Let's do this for now. It's more cinematic with the swooping camera angles and stuff. Oh, it's so cool. It's so weird to see it so high res as well. Link. Yeah, what's up? You are the light. Am I really? Our light. Well, get that your own. Must shine upon high rule once again. All right. Now go. Where? Oh, <laughs> just leave. Get out of here, Link. Mike. All right, let's go. So the way this um, mode works is that when you're in first well when you're walking around like this you're in first person obviously if you swim or climb uh then it goes it zooms out to third person because otherwise you you just see a wall up in your face right so that makes sense so it remains third person for swimming and climbing which i think is brilliant and then then it just cuts back to and obviously for cutscenes as well but then it just cuts back to the first person so that is the first clever thing that they've done. I'll show you more clever things after this amazing shot. It's so cool, it's so pretty.
the heck you say? I know, right? It's so pretty. Right? Jessica, thank you. I did it myself. It's old man! Okay, so another cool thing that you can do in the emulator uh, is to set the draw distance. So you can see when I go out here, you can see that over by where he is, sort of, by the tree over there, you can see that the grass... St well, I don't know if this actually shows up in the stream all that much, but you can see that in the distance, blades of grass stop rendering, and it's just a green, flat texture. You can change that in the emulator as well. I have it set to high draw distance now, I think, but it also goes to ultra and, like, extreme or something. You can see even further, depending on what your computer can, can do. I chose to prioritize uh, a, a, a higher solid frame rate. But, anyway, here we are. We're in the world. Look at how pretty everything is. Look at how cool it is to watch or to view the world from, from this perspective. You get such a cool sense of scale for everything. Everything seems so, like, more, like, vast. It's awesome. Imagine seeing this in VR as well. So, another cool thing that they've done for fighting, if you- if I equip this... Oh, no. I equip it. Now I can fight, uh, like this. And I just see swing in the stick. Right? That's kind of weird. But... You can also choose to not do that when you get into an actual battle. I'll show you in a bit. But you can fight like this, and you just see the little stick go, or go in front of your face. Kind of cute. Uh, there's nothing I can fight around here, so we'll move on. Though. Look at how vivid and colorful it is. It's awesome. Man, I can't wait to explore the rest of the world. We gotta do some temples first, though, so we get the, the glider. Hey, old man, what's up? Hagrid, how you doing? You can also turn off the cell shading. And it looks really weird. The go the the moblins, they are like really, they look really slippery and, and wet. It's kind of gross. Oh shit! I took your apple. Sorry. <laughs> I beg your pardon. I was me. I meant to talk to you. Uh, I could not resist pulling your leg. Don't pull. Don't pull body parts of kids you meet in the woods. Anyway, is there a mod for no weapon damage? I wish. I don't think so. I know that there's a mod for spawn motorcycle. But that requires the DLC and I don't have the DLC. I guess I could get the DLC and try the motorcycle, but I feel like maybe we <laughs> we can we can we can deal deal with that some other time potentially. Hmm? Yeah. I have yeah, I have infinite health and infinite stamina. So, so far, we can climb basically anything and go anywhere without worrying. So that's kind of fun. Whoa! Now we can inspect people, like, real close, like... So weird looking. Wait, am I on fire? Nah, we're good. Okay, bye! Oh. Oh, yeah. Link. Yeah, what's up? Head for the point marked on the map in your Sheikah Slate. Yeah, okay. I'll do that. I'll do that. Don't worry about it. Yeah, the DLC has a motorcycle, apparently. It's it's scary now. I can't see if I'm uh, um, if I'm dying or not. Well, I guess I can't die. I wonder what happens if I jump off the plateau. I think that'll just kill me outright, though. Because that doesn't take away hearts. That actually just kills you. No matter what. But... We can move on. <gasps> Dude, we can see a uh, Yahaha in real life. Hang on. Put your put your thing away, Link. <laughs> nice. Yeah. I did it. I ju yeah, I found you. You're not Hestu. No, that's right. But you can see me. Mm, yeah, you can. I can see you really clearly. It's like putting putting on I assume glasses. I haven't uh, I probably need glasses at some point. If I if I was gonna get a driver's license, I think I'd need glasses. Wait. Oh, uh, whoops. I have X and Y reversed. That's okay. Or is it? Yeah. That's what that's from? Yahaha? Yeah, Hell yeah. It's when you find a new new one. A new guy. Uh let's see. Sword. Aw. So neat. All right, let's go back. 
We gotta fight. I'm gonna show you the fighting as well, because... Whoa. Because, um, there's... You can turn off... Okay, so when you fight things, right? Remember there's, like, a depth of field kind of, kind of thing happening? You can turn that off for improved performance, but I chose to keep it on because it looks so pretty. But, so rather than doing this, right, and like blindly trying to fight, uh, fight a guy, which you can totally do, like this. You can also, when you lock on to an enemy, it goes back to third person and it blurs the background, like that. Very nice. Smack me. Woohoo! Don't actually, though! Look at how pretty that looks with the background, though. No, 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 I want to look at the pretty blurry background. Okay, you die now. Smack me, smack me. Oh! Oh, I shouldn't have done that. Should not have done that. Yeah. It's very helpful. It's so smart. It's super smart. Like, the way they've implemented the, the first-person mod... Obviously, you can play it without the first-person mod. It's literally, like, a list of checkboxes that you just add. Um... And you just check the things that you want. So, you can play it normally without any health cheats or without any first-person mods or anything. Just play it the way... The way you would on the Switch. <laughs> I've just chosen to, to spice things up a bit because I want to... I want to look at the world. I want to explore. Like Mike. This is what Mike saw all that time when we were playing the game. This is what it was like for him. So pretty. Okay, I want to kill more things because it looks cool when the background gets all blurry. Sorry! I- yeah, you're a noble sacrifice for my blur. Oh. Well, it was short but sweet. Yeah, I get it. The guardians, yeah. I wonder, I really wonder what blocking a guardian laser would look like in first person. It's gotta look insane, right? Woo! Go, 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 Bam! Peace! Basically, I just want to... I look at things. Maybe we can even go to the castle and see Ganon first person. Because I can't die. We could totally do that. Maybe. <gasps> There's so many possibilities, man. The horse riding? Oh, yeah, shit. I wonder what that's going to be like. Is it going to be like really... <laughs> Is it gonna be really bumpy, up and downy, like when you ride first person in uh, Red Dead Redemption 2? It didn't work so well, did it? It looked kind of, kind of, kind of dopey. It's very like a lot of camera shake. Temple of Time. Yeah. Look at how big everything is. You don't get the sense when you're like flying, flying camera three, three, three meters over the ground behind him. You know. So cool. Wait, there's a dude here, isn't there? Oh, yeah. Hello! Let's fight first person, okay? Ooh. No, no! No, no! Wait, can I do backflips in, like, first person? Nah, it's not gonna work, is it? Whoops! Like, come on. Okay, let's do this. Oh, dude, we're amazing! Peace. <laughs> that was fun. That's what riding a horse is like. I mean, I guess so. I just wish that maybe they... Maybe they smoothened it out a bit. Man, could you imagine this as well with like a... Uh, if, if someone, if some insane person went and made all the textures, like, also high res, and like, implemented bump maps and normal maps, for everything? Oh, that'd be so good. It'd be the best game in the world. I mean, it's it's already pretty good, but... Man, now I don't have any superpowers. I don't have any bombs. I feel... I feel... I feel lost and alone. Naked. Can I talk to you? Yo, what's up? The goddess... The goddess statue smiles upon you. Well, that was it. Well, anyway. Peace. Yep. Let's find a horror store. That's gonna... I... Oh... I don't remember where he is. Hey! Dude! 
capturing horses? That should be like so easy now because I don't have stamina, right? I can just, I can just, I can just hang on forever. I feel like I'm cheating. Well, I am cheating. It's pretty cool though, right? I can't wait for paragliding. Yeah, the pa that's why I want to get the glider. I just want to float somewhere in first per- I was trying to, uh, in, I was trying to add a- someone had uploaded a hundred percent save file. So that it was supposed to- you were supposed to be able to add that into your folders. And then basically you just load that game and you just- it would just be completed. You'd just have a hundred percent of the game. Uh, I- I was trying to get that to work, but I couldn't really- I couldn't- I couldn't do it. I just couldn't do it. I was too stupid, okay? Oh, but I think it was a uh, it was a version incom incompatibility kind of thing. Cuz I was following a tutorial and it said do this and this and add the folders there and I did that, but then it didn't work. And that was like for version 12 and this is version 15, so I think it was just broken. I push this off anyway. <laughs> <laughs> that works. Why not? We don't need bombs. We can just do that. <laughs> Pretty sweet. Alright, let's steal our food and go. A seared steak. Hell yeah. I'm out. Um, alright. Let's go watch the uh, towers Thanks, erect. Uh oh. Ooh. Wait, I haven't been... I haven't done any shooting bow and arrow. Carry Berry, thank you for gifting us up. Also, we need to, we need to go find some bow and arrow. And also, Charlie? Carly Queen? Uh oh, uh oh, don't do it. Lee Purple 100 bonus in wish I could stay longer. But time for me to go to election. Have a nice stream Go to election? Oh, a lecture. Okay, that makes sense. Thanks, Nat. Have fun at the lecture. Yep. What does this you've stumbled into? Oh, you know, just some regular good old-fashioned Zelda. Nothing, nothing, nothing special changed about this at all. Oh. Damn. Now I don't have... Yeah, I know. Now I don't have the... Now I don't have motion control for, like, aiming the bow. Okay, wait, how do I aim the bow? So... So do I... Oh, okay, it goes third person for the bow as well. Oh, that's pretty neat. I get, I get, I get that. Oh, this is gonna be tricky. Or is it? <laughs> Suck it. All right, anyway. Yeah, it's total 100% normal vanilla Zelda. On the, uh, running on the, this is the Wii U version. Little known fact, a lot of people think that the, the, the Switch version is the best. This is what the Wii U version looks like. It's, it's, it's 2K, 60 FPS. That's that all this time. It's been that, it's been like that. All right, cool, we got some shit. Let's do the tower. So I think these things are gonna be unchanged because they're movies, right? Maybe, are they? That's all right, let's do it. No mods at all. Nah, not a single one. Yeah, uh, it, there's also a clarity filter added that I, I think it just sort of, makes things uh, a bit more contrasted and vivid. So it just looks nicer in general. It's pretty sweet, yo. It's pretty cool. I like it. I'm okay with this. Yeah, this is still, well, this still looks pretty good, though. Even though it's a video. It's not 60 FPS, though, but it's good. It's good. <sighs> now, this is like a blast from the past now. Now, uh, now this is super nostalgic. Because we did, remember when we started out with Mike? Oh, so long ago now. Yeah, hey, yeah, get them towers up, yo. Mike still got it. We still get the towers up. Sweet. Hole in one. <gasps> I don't even have that button anymore. I do. Wait. 
We have a shot. Dude, we totally have a shot. There's gonna drip, right? It is! Can he do it? I don't remember when, when it was. Was it now? Close! I feel like that was close for, for my first try. Hole in one! We did something at least. <sighs> Alright, now we gotta go talk to Old Man McGee and get our, uh, get our sass on. Let's be sassy Mike this time. Practice round, yeah, for sure, practice round. <gasps> Wait! been asleep for the past 100 years. Could you speak up a bit? Beast. When the beast regains its true power, yeah. this world will face its end. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Seems, seems sucky. Why would I want a first person? Because I can, obviously. Oh, so pretty. Nintendo. Look at the potential, Nintendo. You must hurry, Link. I mean, graphics, obviously, okay, graphics aren't everything, but they help. Before it's too late. They help. <sighs> Imagine playing the whole game like this for the first time. I'm blown away. Hmm. Zoom in, please. Do it. <laughs> I'm in him. I'm in Mike. So we could totally just do this now, right? Because I'm invincible. Let's test my theory. Yep. Oh! Hey, what you call me? Just because I'm invincible and you're not. Stupid old ghost man. What's up? <laughs> we have an enigma here. How did you jump off the tower without hurting yourself? I know, right? Up until you're fighting something more than a book hoblin. Listen here, little hog. Obviously, you're not caught up. It goes third person when you're fighting. We've been through this. You're late to the stream, okay? The door is locked. You gotta go, you gotta wait outside. Man, I wish they would do that on movie theaters. If if the movie starts, when the movie starts, I wish that they would lock the doors. I must be silent. I must be silent the whole time. Silent protagonist. Yeah. Like a classroom, like a sassy classroom teacher, you know? They just lock the doors. Nope, sorry, you can't show up when the movie started. Previews, I guess it's okay. It's still annoying, but you know. Yeah, maybe. What if you need a pee? Well, maybe like it can it can it can open from the inside. But you can't get back in. And also, like they unlock the doors like a half hour into the movie. Uh courageous one, do you need do you intend to make your way to the castle? Dot dot dot. <laughs> You need not say a word. <laughs> oh, I can't, man. My throat... Do you think I can speak? I've been in a coma for a hundred years. My voice is shot. I've at... My, my vocal cords have atrophied. Ew, can mm. they do that? Gross. Paraglider? Hand it over! <laughs> oh, ho, ho, certainly, why not? <laughs> but there's no such thing as a free item in this world, you know. Mm. Oh, yeah? What if I cheat? punk. Alright, fine. I'll go do your thing. Woo! Woo! Adventure log. Yep, got it. Cool. Show. Let me show you something. Okay, do it. Oh. Dude, you're so big. He's so big. Whoa! Whoa! You're totally a Hagrid. Wait, am I? I can barely touch your elbow, man. What the hell? Why are you so big? What did you eat? Who did you eat? Don't look at me like that. Talk to me. Oh. What's up? See the structure over there? Yeah, I do. I've been there. Mm-hmm. Oh, the bird. Yep, 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 yep. He's super big. He is totally a Hagrid. Oh, you can also change the reflections. I haven't done that, I think. 
Uh, but you can make, you can enable better reflections. And you can also super sample, you, you can up-res the uh, shadow maps. So, I think these shadows are... They're pretty clear, as you can see. And I think I'm running, if I remember correctly, I set it to double. So it's two times the uh, quality of the shadows that would be in the normal game. Uh, you can set it up to eight times, I think, to get like super clear shadows. But, because uh, you can see them flicker in the distance like that until I get close to them. So you can, you can, you can change that. But shadows uh, tend to really bring down performance. So I chose not to go too crazy. But look at how pretty everything is. So vivid. What is it? Oh, shush. Take one of these. Smack him. <laughs> Uh-oh. His friend didn't like that. Doop! All right. I'll smack you normally. Come here. Come here. Let me smack. Let me smack. Oh, snap, man. That's what happened. That's what's up. Oh. Everything is gorgeous. Yeah. Everything is gorgeous. Wait, how do I shield again? Oh, yeah. Everything is gorgeous. Everything is neat. When you're killing this guy with one shot. One sh Two shots. Three shots. Damn it. I'm no Widowmaker, okay? I will admit this. Oh, wait! Hello! Okay, I didn't know you could do that. That's pretty amazing. Okay. Let's kill everybody and let's go have a... Oh, we could have a little cookout. Why not? Let's murder everyone. It's so sad. I kind of want to fight like this because I kind of want to see your face up close. Come here, man. Wait, where'd you go? Oh, you look weird. Ew! Who's going to throw dirt at me? They are kind of cute, yeah. They're cute now. They're not cute when you turn off the cell shading. When you turn off the cell shading, everything looks sweaty. Everything looks moist. It's kind of weird. We could do that after the break. After the break, I could change some settings just for fun. Um, and we could see what it looks like without the cell shading for a little while. Oh, some entrails. Sweat of the wild, yeah, pretty much. Uh, okay, let's go do that temple so we can get our glider on. Because I really want to... I just want to soar in first... <gasps> the dragons, yo. Remember the dragons? Can we see a dragon in first person, please? Oh, yeah. I'm just swing forever now. It's too sweet. Wait, I can fly forever because I'm infinite. I'm all-powerful. Link is the god of this world now. I'm okay with this. These are much bigger than you think, right? Everything is much bigger than you think. Whenever you go into a game that's you- Oh wait! Could I not do... This? Yeah. When Whenever you go into a game that's usually- Oh, whoops. Usually like, third person. Oh, whoops. Stupid Nintendo buttons. Maybe I should just change that. Hmm? Whenever you go into a game that's usually third person, and then you can do it first person, like when they added first person to, to Grand Theft Auto, Everything looks so huge. Why is that a case? Maybe, maybe they have to make things really big for scale to look proper in third person. Anyway. Yeah. Pretty cool, right? It's pretty pretty. I like it. You want to go underwater? Oh. Wait. But Link can't, though, right? Mike could. I don't know about Link. All right, skip this. Ooh. <laughs> it goes, wait, it goes first person for that little bit. Okay, fair enough. I wonder if you can, if there's a button you can set to switch between third and first uh, person on the fly. No idea, actually. <laughs> it just makes him invisible. So that's basically okay. So that's how they've done it. They make the the character model invisible, and they just place the camera where he would be. Although that's not strictly true because this isn't invisible. Hmm. 
It's go wait a minute. Wait, I need magnet powers. Don't I need magnet powers for this? I can't do that without magnet powers. Dang it. Stupid. Oh, wait. I get them here, right? Man, it's been too long. <laughs> Mike is super tiny. I mean, he is a kid, isn't he? Or like a teenager. At most. Kind of. There you go. Technically he's over 100. I, yeah, for sure. No, he's not. He's biologically... He's mentally young. But biologically, not so much. That's how I relate to him. Oh, okay, so there's... Okay, so it goes third person. That's interesting. boo doo doo boo doo boo I really like how they did the third, third, first person swap. It's really clever. Because a lot of these things would kind of be annoying to do, to have to do in, in third person. Wait, why do I need this? That totally works. Perfect plan. Wait a minute. Nope. <laughs> Stop doing things! Okay, wait. Hang on, let me just, let me just, let me just... There you go. There you go. No, no. There you go. Don't worry about it. There you go. Shoot! Oh, but I want to look at him. Okay, let's... Let's take a quick peek. Oh, you look bizarre. No, no! Hello. Aw, oh, you're kind of my height. No, no. Wait, I can't die. <laughs> Idiot. I can't die. I forgot. I can't die. <laughs> oh, fun. This game is nice when you when there's no threats at all. I was playing... Uh, that's the only time... The only time I've ever beaten a boss in Dark Souls was once when I downloaded a, a mod thing that gave you... Basically, it froze your health bar. So there, you couldn't take damage. Did I just... Ow! It's pretty sweet. Yeah. That, look, I don't... Sometimes, you just don't want a challenge. Sometimes you just want to have a little bit of a fun time. Yeah, I threw it in my face and it bounced in the water, okay? Shh. Let's pretend like nothing ever happens. Oh. Awkward, it's a pool. All the old men! Dude, we get to look at... The aunt, uh, Auntie Isma later on, maybe. I can't wait to see every person in this game. Alright, it's been fun. Let's talk. It's been, it's been fun. Let's talk. Wait, how do we talk? How do I talk to you? Talk? Wait. How do I talk? Talk? Wait. Wait, how do we talk? How do we talk to you? Let's let's talk, shall we? You want to talk? Hey, wait. Let's talk. Uh-oh. Does this not work in first person? None of the buttons do anything. Wait, hang on. Maybe I should swap out a first person. Oh, there you go. Wait. It's just very particular. Oh, okay. I had to stand in the right spot. See, I mean, obviously the game isn't made to be played like this, so there's gotta be, uh, there's gotta be iffy moments, but... Just the fact that it works at all and that it runs this well is awesome. Because getting games to run on emulators, like even even still, like running some Nintendo 64 games don't always work out. Because basically the your computer has to has to act, has to pretend to be another type of hardware. And it doesn't always go all that well. So I'm just I'm just impressed with how people have managed to figure this shit out. It's pretty cool. Alright, anyway. I'll take your orb. Yeah, please give me the balls. I just want to see how this looks in HD.
I'm surprised at how well everything holds up, actually, in terms of... Like, the only, the only thing you can really tell isn't meant for this resolution is, like, some of the rock textures, natural textures. Everything else totally works. Hmm? I like it. I've, I'm probably going to be playing this game just for fun in my own time, like this. Uh, not first person, probably, because I think it's... When it comes down to actually doing the things, uh, it's probably more more trouble than it's worth. Whoa! Oh, now he's going to show off again, isn't he? God damn it. Stop tantalizing me. What's up? Yeah, I got a ball. How did you... Paraglider, please? <laughs> Slow down for a moment, my courageous friend. The appearance of these towers... Uh... It's all connected. Paraglider, please. <laughs> I have yet finished speaking! <laughs> Mike. 2.0. Come on. I'm impatient. I want to go. Yeah, okay. It's very interesting, isn't it? Hmm. Yep. The shrines are tucked away all over the... Three more. Okay, let's do it. I will give you a paraglider. I need more now? Hmm. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. You got it. I'll do it. Don't worry about it. Hmm. Now I won't get it ever. Nah, I'm too rude. Why are you so happy about me being a spoiled brat, man? You should you should be very upset. You should be disappointed in the hero. See the blue icons? Yes! Cool. I can travel instantly now. It's pretty sweet. Ooh, I think... Uh, I might be wrong in this, but I think some of the effects, like the wind and the hair and the fire. Maybe not the wind, maybe the fire. I think some effects run better and faster on, on here than they do on uh, on the Switch itself. Because the Switch has a lot of slowdown issues. Like, this game really pushes the Switch to the limit. I'm so impressed by this. This is so cool. Look at how pretty this. Look at... <sighs> Nice. Nice. So anyway, let's go do more shit for Mr. Old M Magoo. And uh, I kind of... Whoo! Oh, no, they're back. Whoo! I kind of... Okay, you know what? Let's save the game. And let's try to just... Just for fun. Let's try to jump off the plateau and see if we die. <laughs> I'm curious. Whoo-hoo! Oh, we can run forever as well. So nice. Look at that. Man, now I want the dude. Well, again, I was going to say I really want the picture mode for the for the camera or for the Sheikah slate. But then again, don't really need it. I could just take a screenshot. This is on the computer. Horses. Okay, let's, let's try it. Yeah, no. <laughs> it just kills you outright. You can't just bail, even though I can't die. <laughs> Uh, fine. I'll do your bidding, old man. Watch me. Watch me. Oh. Long time viewer, short time subscriber. Love you, cute boy. <laughs> Thanks, tiny sorcerer. Four months isn't that short, though. It's almost half a year. But thank you for the reset. As long as you're you're enjoying your stay, that's all that matters. I'm gonna go get more shit done. And sneeze? Nope. They went away! Damn it. I'm gonna be unsatisfied for the rest of my life. Look at how pretty this forest is as well. Everything is awesome. Man, I can't wait to see... Uh, I can't wait to see Kakariko. Woohoo! With all the lights and all the, the little fires and torches, apparently there's a there's a fix or like the, there's a there's a checkbox that you check that's called Kakariko Torch Shadows, and it makes me go, are there not shadows in the main game when you get to Kakariko Village? And also, are there shadows now, then? Dude, we're totally gonna see the fairy fountains up close and personal as well. It's kind of dark in here. 
Imagine Tarrytown. Yeah, see, that's why I wanted, uh, that's why I wanted a, a full, like, 100% save game as well. Because it would be so nice to just visit everywhere. Like, Terry, com a completed Tarrytown and all those places. Oh, well. I mean, I could just do Tarrytown myself in my own time, and then we can just come back some other time. But, for now, this is what we get. Also, check that shit out. No stamina, yo. I'm the most powerful person ever. I can take out Ganon with a stick. Well, it's gonna break. A lot of sticks. Maybe. Technically, I could. As long as I get the bomb ability, I could just go take out Ganon. It'll take a long time, but I could do it. <laughs> OP, please nerf. Kind of, right? Can I not take freezy damage either? Temperature's getting low. The sun is getting real low, big guy. Wham! Peace! I guess not really peace, technically. War! Yeah, okay, yeah, I got it. Yep. I need to go there. Whoop! Hello! Ooh! There's... Dang it. Help! There's also, uh, there's also cheats you can do, or checkboxes you can enable for infinite oh the game thinks i'm taking damage that no, was fine don't worry about it there's checkboxes you can enable for infinite uh hero powers so you can have infinite rivali's gale and you can have infinite rubosa's fury and you can have infinite mifaz's revenge and infinite other guy shield I don't know if you need to get the, I, I, I'm assuming you need to get the abilities first. But having infinite Rivali's Gales seems like an absolute blast. Anything that furthers easy exploration is, is all I'm about. Getting getting to cool places quickly and fun, funnily. Dang it! They froze me! Help! Fine, I guess... Did they... Stop! Stop! Will you please? You're just trying to go places. Don't poke me, okay? Go poke someone else. Ow. Stop! Just let me go! Just let me go, please! Go, go, Mike! Okay, we're good. I think... Maybe I could... Maybe I could just sort of... Quickly go and do... Do the bird. And get the gale. I'm setting too many goals for myself, though. Let's focus on getting to Korok Forest. I wonder if I can pull out the sword already. Because technically I have infinite health. But I don't have infinite parts. I wonder how the game works when it comes to that. But anyway, first of all, we need a glider. And I need to change my buttons, because X and Y are swapped, because it's confusing. Hmm. I'm not worthy, yet. Probably not. But I'm immortal, though. I'm- I'm the chosen one. Three hearts, Master Sword speedrun, exactly. <laughs> Maybe. I don't think we can do that. Cryon is gum trial, what- Oh yeah! I remember this one. I can beat Ganon right now. Well, not yet. When I get the technically, as soon as I get the glider, I can I could go beat Ganon. Hole in one. Hold in one. <sighs> Alright, sweet. So far so good. If I can't die, you could get the master sword. Well, maybe. But the thing is. It might just count your actual hearts, and while I can't lose hearts in battle, I still only have three hearts. So I'm gonna I'm gonna assume that the the master sword would count my hearts, and not just actually take my take it health take my health away. We'll try it when we get there. 
Take my health away. Bam, bam. Bam, bam. Ow. Bam, bam. Take my health away. Bam. Stop it. Come back. Woo. Shoot. Oh, Mike. You sack of potatoes. Just kill him. Just like that. Poof. Poof. Like a slughorn. Poof. Poof, Professor. Poof. Uh, alright. I think I'll do it. Poof. How many hearts do I need? 13, you need. 13 hearts to get the, the Master Sword. Poof. I know, right? Do, 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 do. That's what I was gonna say. Uh, do I wanna get to that, potentially? Do we care? Nah, not really. <sighs> cool, right? It's pretty nice. Alright. So far, we're doing okay. How long has it been? It's been, it's only been an hour. I feel like I'm doing okay in terms of progress. And I've sort of learned that you need to, I think what I need to do is make sure that the, the link is facing because I think that was the issue before I was actually fa the character model was facing the other way but the camera was pointing towards the dude so I have to make sure that I'm also facing the same way I think that was that was the issue that I was having 10 more needed yeah pretty much and you get you need four orbs per heart so yeah I don't think we're going to do that this stream. But anyway. Yeah. We're doing something at least. It's kind of fun. I like it. Man, I really want to see... Where would be the best place for the dragons? I want to see a dragon up close and personal. Oh, shush, Mike. Where are the rest of the... Shrines? I forget. Like Hylia? Oh yeah, you're right. Like Hylia would probably be a good, good spot for some dragon. Hello? Someone's rolling snowballs at me. Uncool. Where are you going? <laughs> Alright, bye. What? No! It killed a... It killed a... What did it kill? An ice bat! An ice bat killed by snow. Hmm. Poetic. Well. No, I don't have the hang glider yet. I'm working on it, though. Should, shouldn't be too bad, since we can't die, so I don't have to worry about cold and stuff. I just need to actually find the other ten boats. It's kind of... Actually, so the game right now is running without any, um... Without an, any anti-aliasing, which you can turn on, but I opted to keep off because, well, the tutorial that I watched said that don't, you don't need it. I agree. <laughs> I mean, maybe it's better. Shield surfing. Oh, shit, you're right. Wait, I don't have a shield. Wait, I forget. How, you, how do you do it? How do you shield again? Oh, no. Okay, so... You gotta jump and... What is it? Jump and... Oh, okay. It goes third person, yeah. Ah, fair enough. The grass is definitely taller than Mike, yeah. Well, you can't cut it... Oh, okay, wait. You can't cut it down. Ha! Suck it. Now who's taller? Boom. That would be fun to first person, you're right. The... 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 Snow surfing. All right, Mike. Jesus. Just get up on this tippy top. I just want to scout. I want to see where all the... Oh, man, being able to infinitely climb and jump, though. It's pretty sweet. Okay. I just want to scout and see where all these temples are. So I can fairly easily... Wait! Over there! That's where uh, Horse Door is. He's right there. Down in there. Right? I remember... A member. Oh, yeah, there's one. Where? Where's one? Dang it. Nintendo buttons? Don't fail me now. Dang it. Nintendo buttons? 
Don't fail me. Okay, thanks. Oh shit, wait. Hello. What's up, man? There are a few things in life filled with most mysteries. It's a breathtaking view. Yep. Did you know about the scope? Yeah, I, I just used it, man. You watched me do it. Pay attention, old man. Damn it. Yeah. yeah. The lighting is very pretty. How did you... I got it. Got it, man. Don't worry about it. Can I push this? Ah, how did you make it? You did well to make it this far without proper clothing. Hey, listen. Don't knock my clothes, all right? I have the fashion sense of a madman. And that's a good thing. For I say so. I'm also invisible, so what does it matter? Search! Wait, search? Oh. I don't know that was a thing. Oh no, Mike! Wait, wait, wait! Now I feel bad. Hang on, don't worry about it. I'll put this on, and I'll put these on. There you go. Feel better, buddy. Uh, okay, so we got that. And we got that. And then that's a tower. Maybe I should just unmark that, to be honest. Can I? Oh, edit pins. I'll, I'll, I'll delete this just so we don't get confused. Mm -hmm. He's pretty handsome. You are pretty handsome as well. Hello. Nice puffs. It's a staring com contest now. Do you have a tri piece of the Triforce on your thingy? Is it because you're the king secretly? Wait, that's a spoiler. Sorry, don't listen to me. Man, you know what would be great right about now? A glider. Don't you agree? Piece of shit. All right, I'm out. See you later. Woo. Shield slide all the way down. I think it's too steep to do that from here. I mean, we could try. Wait. It's kind of... It's kind of finicky to... There he goes. No, I can't do it. Wait! Perfect! Oh, 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 no, okay, yep. No, we're doing it, totally. Perfect. Yeah. Yeah, look at him go. <laughs> Woo! Ah, uh, that was fun. It was a little bit underwhelming, but, you know, could have been... Could have been... I get it could have been better, to be honest. Could have been worse as well, I suppose. Nailed it. I did. I was, I was expecting the shield to break. Because it's red already. Why do I- why am I dying all the time? Oh, because it's cold, right? Oh, well. Mike- Mike can tank it. He's- 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 he's good at this stuff. He's good at sucking it up. Come on, buddy. Where is the- oh, look, look at the little raft! Where are you going? A little own adventure? Without me? Oh. Alright, anyway. Oof! <laughs> you're like you're you're stuck for a little while because Mike needs to needs to recoup. Oh. What's happening? Hello? Who am I? Mike. That's it. Oh, ho, ho. Into the fire and flames you go, man! Oh, no. Don't you think about it? Don't you think about it? Thank you. Ah, oh, cozy. Can I sit in first person? No, I just want to chill. I guess you could just pretend that I am. <sighs> Stand in the fire. No! Wait. But I can't die. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Mike. Alright, let's go to this. Oh shit, there's gonna be guardians here, aren't there? Uh, yeah, we can tank him. I wanna deflect. I wanna really... Okay, I can deflect in first person. I really want to see if I can manage to deflect a guardian beam in first person. 
but my weapons, that's okay. I'll buy new ones with the stolen money. A badass like that. All right, Mike, listen. Do you want to take one for the team? Yeah, you do. Ooh. Oof. <laughs> you can see on his shadow that he's like, oh, God, mustn't show weakness. Okay, we're done. We did it. No, oh, Mike, come on. Old man out. Oh yeah, that's right. I use my ability points to negate the fall damage. It's the crossover we all we were all waiting for. Cassandra versus Mike. It's the love child. Look at how vibrant this is. Crazy looking. I like it. Well. <laughs> just, yeah, just slightly charbroiled Mike. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Come on, Mike. Jesus. Wait, isn't there... Uh, I'm trying to remember where the last shrine is. Is it up here? Is it over there? There's something over... Oh, there! It is there! I was gonna say, there should be one right, right around here. There you go. Might as well. We're close to it, so let's do it. Can't wait to see Beetle up close! Oh, shit, yeah, you're right. I want to see every character up close. I want to look at everyone's faces real intently until it's like super uncomfortable and then I want to keep doing it. Because what are they going to do? I'm Mike, Link. The one? They can't kill me. What are they going to do? Put me in a jail? I'll just sit there until the jail cell crumbles around me from erosion. Time is nebulous to me. I've been in a pool for a hundred years. What's 20 in jail gonna do? Psh, I scoff at the... Oh, shit. Oh, I remember. Heh! <laughs> Perfect! <laughs> the old man. I was just, he doesn't even say anything now. He just doesn't want anything to do with me. Dang it. Don't kill me. No! No! Well, you can't. Poor guys. I should feel good. And I do. How do I... Oh, yeah, remember this bit where I was falling down a lot? Let's not fall down a lot this time. It's impossible. Come on, Brick. Now, you're, now I'm gonna get so spoiled. I can never play the original again. It's gonna just feel so sluggish and so blurry. And I'm gonna die all the time and fall off everything because I'm not gonna have infinite things. Dang it. I've ruined Zelda. It was me all along. <laughs> that was the bit I first called him Mike. Oh shit. We've done it. We've rekindled the old times. Alright. Well, so far so good. Very meta. Is this where I start calling him Link again then? This is the reversal. He's been Mike so far. Now he's Link. Cool. <laughs> got a got a terminator around a little bit. Yeah, we've come full circle, exactly. We did it. No? Maybe. Oh wait. Hole in one. There it is. That's the perfect one. You need the oh when the drop uh, lets go and the bling when the hits when it hits. That's perfect. That was the perfect one. I'm happy with that. Hmm. Hole in one. For sure. For real. Alright, let's freeze this. Da can't do that. Boop. Thank you. Oh wait a minute. How's this gonna work for the motion controlled puzzles when I don't have motion control? Uh oh. 
<laughs> oh, I can't die. It's amazing. I instinctively, when I'm like aiming, I'm instinctively, in instinctively like tilting the controller slightly to like correct my aim. Can't do that. Doesn't work like that. Uh oh. Well, wait a minute. Ah, no. <laughs> All right, anyway. I can take it. Mike Mike has been Mike has been secretly working out. Do you think that was water he was he was sleeping in for a hundred years? Uh-uh. That was it was G Fuel all along. Steroids. Liquid steroids and stem cells. A soup. A soup mixed out liquid ste steroids and stem cells with G Fuel powder in it. That was it. That's why I was uh, sleeping in all those years. I'm good. Don't worry about it. Uh, I don't want to waste my cool ass hammer though, but I kind of do want to see what it looks like. Okay, so you know what I think they've done here? I think, yeah, I think I am invisible. My weapon is invisible. The only thing I can see is the the motion swipe graphics, but it's kind of clever. It totally works. Oh, uh, hit the old man every time. It's kind of cool though. So many clever little things. Yeah! I wonder how long this took to what up? implement. I hit six months. Thanks for helping me through my last semester of college. Ah, Redwood. Thank you for six months. And congratulations on your last semester of college. You're almost an, a real human being. No? Maybe. Mike is the next Captain America. Hell yeah. All along. This was what, what everything was building up to. Dum, da, 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 da. Okay, cool. Three, one more. And then we finally get the glider. So when I get the... I think that's a good... That might be a good uh, point for a pee break as well. When we get the glider, uh, we'll, 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 we'll swap it out. For, for... Maybe we should try... I kind of don't want to... Okay, let's try the game without cell shading for a little bit, but I kind of don't want to play it like that because it looks gross. But for now, huh? whoops. No problem. Do, 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 do. It looks good sometimes, but also mostly not. I've seen some screenshots of the game without the cell shading, and it looks like oh, so it could work. But then you see like enemies or things up close, and you're like, "Oh no, I see why they did this now." No, no, go go down. The superhero landing, three pointer. Okay, let's bail on these guys. Sorry, I'm not in the mood, guys. Next time, maybe. You're gonna follow me. Aren't they? Nah, we'll be fine. I just need to kill one more. Ooh, do I have shields? Yes, I do. Okay, I really want to try to deflect. Uh, because there, there's going to be guardians down here, right? The dead ones or the the ones with no legs. Also, hug collector. Thank you for gifting us up. It hasn't dinged yet. It's going to ding. Why doesn't it ding sometimes? I wonder. Hmm. Perhaps a bag to hurl into for the for the gliding. No, it'll be fine. Maybe, or maybe not. Maybe we'll maybe maybe it'll be horrible, a horrible experience for all. But we'll we'll do it anyway. We have to. No, I think it'll be awesome. Now, if you could just implement the VR thing that they've added to the game. In this version. Oh shit. Because I, as I understand it, the VR version or the VR edition is mainly just like a 
Oh, it goes into that. The VR implementation that they've done is mainly just like a, you can stand and look at things in VR. It's not like actual gameplay, I think. I don't know, it does. There he goes. Peace. It's nothing really. Yeah, I think it's just like a, a dia diorama kind of look at things thing, right? Maybe? Alright, anyway. Oh, wait. Oh, the bombs. I need the bombs. <laughs> you have to hold it to your face the entire time. Yeah, that was also a weird thing. The Nintendo VR thing doesn't come with straps, so you have to, like, hold it like this for the entire time. Kind of weird. I mean, I get it. I don't think that anything in VR on the Switch would work very well anyway. Because it's like a 720p screen. The whole thing is a 720p screen. The very, very, very first dev kit for the, for the Oculus was 720. Now they're like, now they're like 2560 per eye or something. Like, like they're, they're 1600 pixels by eye, per, per eye, right? The new ones. And that was 720p for the whole field of view. So anything you look at in, uh, in the VR switch thing is going to look horrible and blurry anyway. So I'm not super into it. I'm not super into it. I'll try it out if someone has it, but I don't think I'm going to buy it. Hole in one. I've learned, I remember now, it's when the camera switches to the drop, it's ding 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 button. That's how you do it. Mm -hmm. Plus that, yeah, it's like 30, 30 dollars, 30 euro to get a cardboard thing. I don't know, I kind of want to, I, I saw that they've uh, released pre-orders for uh, the Oculus Quest and the Oculus S now. I kind of want to get one of those. Oh, that was a little bit dinky. Well, wait, how do I do it? Like, no! Oh, yeah. Yeah, the, the new Oculus S. The quest... The quest could be cool. But... Um, so, the, so they've, they've done an Oculus S and an Oculus Quest. The Oculus Quest is completely standalone. Like, no computer needed. It's just a headset. But obviously, it's not going to be as powerful. Um, well, the game's on it won't be as powerful as a game on a computer because it's just a little VR headset. It can't run that much. But supposedly it does run Beat Saber flawlessly. And that means you can play Beat Saber in just the headset. No no tethers, no computer, nothing else added. Which sounds pretty radical. So I kind of, I'm kind of curious about that. But the other thing they're doing is the Oculus S. No! Dang it. Which is just the new Oculus. The Oculus 3, 2, whatever. The new Oculus for computers. I'm kind of curious about them. Specifically the, I think if the Oculus... Quest isn't super expensive. As in, you can like buy it for a birthday or Christmas. Like, I could see that being a thing where, like, oh, wait a minute. <laughs> I could see the Oculus Quest being a thing that par parents maybe buy for their kids to share, like, or for the family for Christmas. Like, hey, look at this. This is for everyone. Here's an Oculus Quest, because I think it's going to be like $2.99. So it's still kind of pricey, but but it's like a thing that you can get as a collective for a family or something. And I think that's going to really, really do a, do a number on VR. Yeah, it's, it's like, it's affordable. It's not, 
It's not like you need a $2,000 computer as well just to run it, you know? Which is the current problem with, I think, a lot of VR. Whee! Anyway. Yeah, I know, the singular block. Just the one. Just the one thing. We couldn't get the whole thing in one go. The one block. Had to ruin it for everybody. <sighs> anyway. Should we kill it? Just because we can. Hell yeah, we should. Screw you! Wait. Mike, listen. It's that way. There he goes. I still haven't tried the PSVR. I kind of don't care that much about it. I don't know. I mean, I like that it exists. The more VR options, the better, because that's gonna make that's gonna mean more VR games. But I don't know. Since I have the vibe, I don't think that I like. I, I want to get the PSVR. Yeah. Aim 100. percent Yeah. Also, quiet nerd. You're continuing a gift sub. <gasps> Thank you. That's fun. I'm glad you're liking your stay. Um. I want to see about, I want to test a theory when we get out of here, because I think, I think the character model of, of Mike is, is, uh, independent of the camera. So you can look one direction and aim oh. another direction. Hello? Oh shit, it's time. Oh! 399 for the, for the for the oculus okay yeah still it's still doable especially considering like phones these days are like two thousand dollars anyway imagine an x on your map imagine an x okay fine don't worry about it yeah i a good a good a good old man <laughs> so if i'm like facing if I do this, yeah, look, cause, cause the camera is is controlled with my with the right stick, and Link is controlled with the left stick, so I can run around, facing one way, with the camera, but the character is facing another way, so I can be facing backwards and throw, <laughs> meaning he throws it over there. <laughs> okay, I see, I, I get it. It's a little bit wonky, but it works. Totally works. All right, let's go. Let's go chat with old man for now. Exact. That's it. Cool guys don't look at explosions. Peace. Oh, that was cool. You just see bones and bits flying all over. Nice. All right. Anyway, we gotta go do this. We gotta talk to old old man, old Mister Man up there. You can totally see him as well. That's kind of cool. You can see the the blue glow up in the. Look, he's right there! You can see him! He's just chilling, waiting. Alright. Woohoo! Woohoo! Who's there? Woohoo! Alright. Good graphics. Hell yeah. Alright. We'll do this. And then, finally, we'll be able to glide. It's the whole purpose. I'm gonna just be... Wait, why is this glowing now? I'm gonna beeline it for uh, Korok Forest because I just really want to see what that looks like. Well, okay, no. Let's go to Kakariko first. Alrighty. Hello. I have a feeling that the Master Sword, from a first-person perspective, with these graphics, now that's wallpaper material. I'm gonna get a heart, please. Not that I need it, but you know. Get horse door? <laughs> Maybe. Well, we'll see. I could always teleport back and go get him. He's just not really... Well, I guess we could, because we're close. We could just fly and get him. Maximum hearts. Aw, oh, yeah. Go and bring priest to, hi pr pr to Hyrule. Ah, oh, shut up. He's on the roof. Oh! Why are you so mad, Mike? 
Ah, I see. You've done things. Peace. That's cool. cool. It keeps calling me a hoe all the time. Ho! Oh! What is it? Pim! Yeah, we kind of need a horse in general, don't we? We need to be able... I want to test out the riding. I want to see if it's bump as bumpy as I'm uh, suspecting it. It's going to be... Oh, look at... Everything is cool. Everything is cool. I like that. <laughs> well done there, young one. Now then, the time has come to show you who I truly am. I was King Rome Bosphoramus Hyrule. No! Bosphoramus? The last Not that guy. Hyrule. A kingdom which no longer exists. Don't flash kids. <gasps> it was that guy all along? The Great Calamity was merciless. It devastated everything in its path. Wait. Though, a century ago. But it was then. We knew each other. Taken away We've him. met. Why does and he introduce himself time, like that? Here I have remained like, yeah, duh. Home. I remember I you. Wise to we you thought I worked for you. Fragile. He's so my old boss, that, basically. I thought it best to assume a temporary form. Oh yeah. Forgive me. Never. I think you are now ready. Ready to hear what happened. One hundred years ago. Please tell me all about it. In extended detail. To know Calamity Ganon's true form, to know... one must know the story I miss from the past. The Demon King was born into this kingdom, but his transformation into malice created the horror you see now. Stories of Ganon were passed from generation to generation in the form of legends and fairy tales. But there was also a prophecy. The signs of a resurrection of Calamity Ganon are clear. Why do you, just, why do you speak so quiet? It, I barely hear you. Beneath the ground. We decided That's to heed the prophecy and began excavating large areas of land. It wasn't long before we discovered several ancient relics made by the hands of our distant ancestors. These relics, the divine beasts, were giant machines piloted by warriors. We also found the Guardians, an army of mechanical soldiers who fought autonomously. He's Hades, yeah. This coincided with ancient legends oft repeated throughout our land. We also learned of a princess with a sacred power and her appointed knight chosen by the sword that seals the darkness. It was they who sealed Ganon away using the power of these ancient relics. One hundred years ago, there was a princess set to inherit a sacred power and a skilled knight at her side. It was clear that we must follow our ancestors' path. We selected four skilled individuals from across Hyrule and tasked them with the duty of piloting the divine beasts. With the princess as their commander, we dubbed these pilots champions, a name that would solidify their unique bond. I remember. The Princess, her appointed knight, and the rest of the champions were on the brink of sealing away Ganon. But nay. Nay. Ganon was cunning, and he responded with a plan beyond our imagining. Somehow it sounds more cheesy when it's in English. It's the exact same story, but it sounds a lot less cheesy in japanese -y. Doesn't it? To me, personally. All day. He appeared from deep below Hyrule Castle, seized control of the Guardians and the Divine Beasts. Oh, nay! Against us. Oh, nay. The champions lost their lives. Those residing in the castle as well. The appointed knight gravely wounded and lapsed while defending the 
Princess. I want to watch that and thus, anime. The kingdom of Hyrule was devastated absolutely by Calamity Ganon. However, the princess survived to face Ganon alone. Link, you are our final hope. Help us, everyone can help me. The fate of rests with you. You're our final hope. Luke. Luke. That princess was my own daughter. Oh shit, my really? My dear Zelda. And the courageous knight who protected her right up to the very end. That knight was none other than you, Link. You fought valiantly when your fate took an unfortunate turn. And then, you were taken to the Shrine of Resurrection. Here you now stand, revitalized 100 years later. The words of guidance you have been hearing since your awakening are from Princess Zelda herself. Even now, as she works to restrain Ganon from within Hyrule Castle, she calls out for your help. However, my daughter's power will soon be exhausted. <laughs> Once that happens, don't worry, Zelda. Ganon will freely don't worry, King. Himself, no one is ever really gone. Nothing will stop him from consuming our land. Considering that I could not save my own kingdom, I have no right to ask this of you, Link. <laughs> you look so bored. Uh, this but shit again. I am powerless here. You must save her, my daughter. He's got a pretty sick bulge. Dude, I think you can play. Wind Waker, like this Somehow, as well, by the way. Ganon has maintained control over all four divine Might beasts, be as well as those guardians swarming around Hyrule Castle. I believe it would be quite reckless for you to head directly to the castle at this point. You believe, eh? I suggest that you make your way east out to one of the villages in the wilderness. Seems as you are not road caught up in my immortality. There you will find the elder Impala. Isma. She Got it. will tell you more about the path that lies ahead. Sure thing. Consult the map yep. on your Shika slate for the precise location of Kakariko Village. Make your way past the twin summits of the dueling peaks. From there, follow the road as it proceeds north. <laughs> okay. I haven't said a thing, but sure. Here's the paraglider. Finally. I did it. I got it. Paraglider. Easy. Isolated plateau. Peace. All right. All right. I'm gone. I'm gone. Okay. Nope. Uh, yep. Yep. I'm gonna fly now. Yep. I think that's it. I have told you. I told you everything I can. Link. Mike. You must save. Hi. Sorry. Save what? <laughs> you just you faded out and oh uh, well. Peace. Oh shit, you ready? Man, you can get some awesome cinematic shots like this from this world. Satisfying. All right, where, 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 I'm going that way, okay. You know what? We can film an E3 demo, exactly. I'm gonna, I'm gonna see if I can hide all of the UI as well. I think you can enable some sort of super, super HUD mode where you don't see anything. But I feel like we should just, let's just head. Let's just, let's just get to, let's just get to Kakariko Village. Or should we get the horse to do that? After the break, maybe? Maybe we should just do that. Woohoo! Gotcha. Alright. I'm gonna... Uh... No. No, no. Yes, yes. So, horse is, like, over here. So, I'm gonna teleport to here. And then we'll go get horse after the break. But so far... This is pretty cool. I really like this, um... Mode. 
obviously the first person thing is more of a gimmick. Uh, well, for me anyway, I don't think I'd play the game the whole way through like this. But I love that you can. I love that it's an option. Because it's super cool to see. Oh shit! Hello. Super cool to see everything from from this perspective. Come here. Come here. Let me stab. Whoops. All right. Where where, where the hell was horse? Where the hell was horse at? He was like not this way. He was like down here, right? Where where am I? Hang on. I need to orient myself. Uh, oops. Was it over there? Wait, where am I? It's over here somewhere, right? It's like down... Down in the trees. Or is it that way? No, no. No, it should be over here. Oh. He's too... Yeah, he's... No, he's, he's down... He's around here, right? If I remember correctly. Could I see it from the tower? Was, was it from the tower I could see it, maybe? Or from the mountain top? No, it was from the mountain top, wasn't it? I'll get up here and have a scout. Let's see, where am I? Where am I? What's happening? Okay. Uh, that's a tower, castles, towers, mountain top. Can I teleport to the mountain top? That would be, that would be lovely. Wait, I can teleport to there. Let's do that. Uh, no, this one. Is that the one? I want to teleport to the highest peak. The highest, the highest peak of the highest tower. The highest point of the highest world. I just want to see where it is. I think he, because he's in, he's in between those, uh, the, 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 the thick three, th thick trees, right? The, 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 the fat logs. Here we go. Oh, is that an updraft? What's up, Draft? I don't know. What's up, Draft, with you? Uh, no. 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 Hey, a little shrine! No. 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 Is it this way? Yeah, the Bowab trees. That's what I said. <laughs> All, all along, no? Uh, no. Hey, treasure! Yeah. Alright, it's this way. It's gotta be this way. It's gotta be around around the corner. I guess we could just climb to the tippy top, because we're kind of close. And I can do this now. I so wish they would add a glider into Assassin's Creed. The next Assassin- hey, listen, developers, Assassin's Creed, uh, what next? Vikings? I think they're doing the Nord- Nordic mythology for the next Assassin's Creed. That was, or, well, it's a rumor anyway. But, hey, Assassin's Creed, next time, please add a glider so that I can jump off of all of the Ubisoft towers and just glide. I, it would just be amazing. It's the one thing that at any any open world game needs is a glider. Please. All right. So, we want to go to There it is. Over there. <laughs> Shh. Be quiet. Fine. Bleed purple 1000 bonus 100. That's it. Thanks, Carrie Berry. <laughs> we want to go over there. We want to get the horse. But we're going to do that after the break. He's gonna land here in preparation. Bam! Down there. Somewhere. Can I just do that now? Is he there already? Or do I have to do something for them to show up? We'll try it out. Uh, I am gonna save for now. Save. And uh, we'll have a little pee break. Because why not? It's been a little while, and I gotta go pee. So, 
He should be there. Okay, let's do that then. But first, fast we pee. Hello. Hello. We're back. We're back from peeing all over. Um, okay, so first of all, let's check out some features that we can do in this game. Uh, I didn't realize this until just now, but you can just switch between cell shading and not cell shading on the fly. So let me do this and check this out. In options, graphics packs, The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Here's all the things that you can do with this game in particular. FPSs and cell shading and cheating. Speaking of, by the way, from before, um, there is a cheat for infinite weapons, bows, and shields. So they don't break. So that's pretty cool. I'm gonna click that one. Boop! Now we have infinite bows and weapons and shields. So now they won't break forever and ever. Uh, mo infinite motorcycle, infinite d arrows. Maybe that should be good. Infinite arrows, why not? Um, but the one that I wanted to try out is the cell shading removal. So look at... Look at Mike now, and look at Mike now. Whoa! Why are there so many versions behind him? Oh shit, look at that. He's so weird. Let's equip another sword. Oh, oh. Okay, can we, well, now I can't look at him. Wait, I wonder if I can switch to third person on the fly. Let me try this, or maybe it'll say like you have to restart. Can you do that? No, I think you have to restart the game. All right, we'll have to climb something to see him. Hang on, I'm gonna turn that back on. Can I not? Oh, there it is. Boop. Boop. Uh, so those are the those those are the things you can do anyway. That's a lot uh, of stuff that you can change. So that's pretty cool, right? That's pretty fun. Um, so let me let me just see if I can actually s this. Maybe isn't meant to work with first person, but look at how weird it looks. Mike? Oh, it's so dark now. Oh wait! I know why. I know why it's dark. Because I didn't click you have to click the fixes, I think, as well. Uh no, not general. Graphic pack. Uh mods, cell shading. Shadow brightness fix. Yeah, you gotta apply those. That should do it. Maybe. It's kind of weird, isn't it? Let's see if it if it's if it's if it's working better. There he is. He's not pitch black anymore. Oh. Look at how weird he looks. He looks so bizarre. It's like no, you're not supposed to be like that. Why? Why do you look like this? What a weird, what a weird fate. Okay, we need to go find, no, no, we, we need to go find, no, no. We need to go find some, some moblins to fight, because that's gonna look... Wait a minute. I switched the buttons, I forgot. We gotta fight some, some enemies, because that's gonna look gross. They look so shiny, but first of all, let's see if we can get this horse. Because we have to. Why is he angry? He's always angry. That's his secret. Stop! Ah! It's there. Okay, here we go. I mean, this is... This should be easy, though, right? Because... Because he's not cel-shaded anymore. Oh, shit! He kicked me! <laughs> Dang it! No, come back! You look weird! Why is your tail made out of rubber? No! Look at him, he's weird. Okay, we might need to... Ew. <laughs> no! The cell, the cell shading does... It does help. I feel like this is gonna be tricky without... In, in first person. Yeah. Everything is made out of rubber. Wait, how do I sneak again? Oh, there you go. Now I'm even tinier. Twizzler horse hair, kind of, yeah. 
He's got a black latex body with twizzlers for mane and tail. Okay. We can do this. Maybe. Don't worry about it. I'm a nice boy. I'm just a little link. No, don't, don't, tail, don't rat, t rat me out. Okay, okay, we got it. Look at his shiny ass. Everything. Hello. New prompt. Mount. <laughs> hey oh! Oh shit! Soothe! How do I soothe? Ho oh, ho! Oh. Ho oh, oh. oh. ho! Ah. Ah. Okay, third person writing as well. Fair enough. But look at how shiny I am! Look at how shiny everything is! Ew! Mike, why are you so shiny? Why are you made of plastic? He was an amiibo all along. They were all amiibos. Amiibos are canon. Dwarf. Mike, why are you giving me the stink eye? What are you looking at? Don't judge me. Look at how weird it looks. So now you can see, okay. So compare, compare and contrast this versus uh, options, graphics. Uh, Breath of the Wild, mods, cell shading. Ah, normal link. Ugh. Ah, ugh. Ah, ah. Uh. ah. Okay, I think we'll stick to that. But just to show you that you can do that. Kind of fun. All right, let's go. Uh, where do we actually go now? Oh, don't we have to like ride like really awkwardly a long way away? Blee purple 100 bonus in the details of the horse hair reminds me of those Betty Spaghetti dolls. I don't know if you have ever heard of them. No. Whoops. But I also don't know if that's a bad thing. If they look like that, maybe I'm okay with not having heard of them. <laughs> but yeah, cannot be unseen. I feel like we should do... <laughs> when we get to... Um, Kakariko. Or, well, any town, really. No, no. Oh. Hold, hold. Hold, hold. Hold, hold. When we get to any town, I want to look at it without the cell shading again, just to see what it looks it's like. It's fun. It's fun. Look at the fun we're having. I know, right? Panda Meister, thank you for the two months. It's fun. No, no. Ho, ho. Ho, door. Ho, door. Ho, door. It's fun. Look at the fun we're having. No, no, shush, shush. Don't worry about it. It's okay. It's only, it's only a bloodthirsty beast. Wait, I can't die. I can kill that guy, no problem. Hold on. Nah, let's fail. You don't see me. You know nothing. Oh. Fail. Fail. Don't, don't hit my horse. Okay, we're fine. Uh, <laughs> or are we? Go! There you go. Don't look back. Don't look back. But I had to. I couldn't resist. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> Solid snake alert. Should write. Shwing! That was another one. Hold on, you're like twice the size of him. Don't worry about it. If you could get infinite money as well, I could buy all of the outfits. Maybe not right into his face, though. Don't worry about it. Can horse door die? I don't know, actually. Can he? Can the special horses... Can, can, if you get Zelda's horse, can you kill Zelda's horse? I feel like that would be a little bit sad. Potentially. He can die, but he's a tough cookie. Oh, okay. Like a like a rock cake from Hagrid's hut. Those are tough cookies as well. Ooh. Uh, okay. Well, your horseback ones, though. I don't really want to fight y'all because y'all a little bit annoying. Uh, I do want to fight a moblin in non cell shade mode, though, just so we can see how how moist they look. Where am I going? I guess to any stable, really. Ow. That's my horse. Don't! I'm gonna get a flat horse! 
tire. Oof. Shoe? Flat shoe! It's like a squished Pikachu. Uh, wait, where am I? Isn't this... Oh no, I'm far away. Dang it. I thought I was coming up on Hateno. Alright. You don't want to see a moist goblin? Why not? Who doesn't want to see a moist goblin? I mean moblin. The best. They're all like... Covered in a sheen of... Of... Baby oil. And sweat. From whatever they were doing before Mike showed up. They're about to wrestle. Oh, maybe that's it. That's canonical now. Okay, I'm just gonna ride until I spot... Oh, oh. A stable. Where is the closest stable? I feel like there should be stables around here. Ah, hi -yo. There you go. Ho, ho. What a majestic sight. How's your crotch, Mike? Ho, ho. He's just a big Pokemon fan. Ho, ho. Lugia. Ho, ho. No, no. No, no. Ho, ho. Okay, we just che we'll just check him in so we we can retrieve him at any point. No, don't worry about it. We're good. Do you think he's jealous of being tiny? Stop! Ho ho. No! Just go straight! He's really Okay. It's hard to control. Okay, there you go. Ah, faster? I know dragons exist. Okay. Hello! Yeah, I want to stable this guy. Don't worry. Yep, I haven't seen your face before. I do know how things work. Hey. Ah, uh, dang it. Yeah, I want to stay here forever. Register my horse, please. Hmm. Ho ho. Ho ho. Yeah, I want to put him in. Not a problem. Oh wait, he needs twenty dollars, doesn't he? I don't have twenty dollars. Mm. Oh shit. Okay, wait. Dang it, I have zero dollars. Okay, horse, could you just chill here for a minute? Don't run away or nothing. I'm gonna talk to Beetle. Ho oh, ho! There he is. Look at his high resolution face. I'm just gonna sell some shit to him. Okay. And then we're fine. That's not enough dollars. You're right. Wow! Wow! Uh, yeah, let me just. Hoo hoo! Let me just give, give me money. Look what I got. I wanna sell you. Two wings. Yep. Two whole wings. And also, I want to sell you... Uh... A steak? $12. I guess I could sell you... Wait, ancient screw. Ooh, do you want a shaft? Hey, take my amber! He doesn't get my shaft. You don't deserve... No, no. Ah, oh, dang it. You don't deserve my shaft. Not yet, beetle. Maybe one of these days. We just met. I do like your sports bra, though. Bye! <laughs> Alright. Now we can go sell... I mean, the stable horse. Yo. No! <gasps> no. Go back. There you go. Welcome to our stable. If you want to put him in, you gotta pay the bill. Uh, okay, I'm, I'm okay with that. Gotcha. Here you go. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Yes. Yeah, I wanna I wanna switch. I wanna just stable my horse. Name the horse. Oh wait, can I do that with the keyboard? <gasps> it works! You can just keyboard uh. it. Yeah. Registration is complete. Orden. Me. Uh -huh. Thank you. Peace. Alright, 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 alright. Yeah, 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 I know, whistle. Whistle for horse. Yep, yep, yep. It totally works every time, no matter how far away you are. You can always do it, and it's perfect. Hey. Hey, buddy. Let's see what you look like without cell shading, shall we? I'm sure you don't look weird at all. Totally. Legend of Zelda. Mods. Cell shading. Uh, burp, burp, burp. <laughs> Why? He's made out of wood. 
Why is he made out of wood? Why is his uh, why are his eyes scary? Yeah. <laughs> oh. I don't like you. Bye. Uh, I know you're sad about that, but you look weird. How do you look? You look okay, actually. I want to look at more things. I want to fight a moblin. Okay, wait. These guys have horses, but we can take one down, maybe. Let's see. Let's do it. <sighs> I want to... Okay. This is going to be a little bit tricky. We have infinite arrows, though. Mm, no! Don't get on the horse, okay? Will you just come fight me? You look at how look at how moist they are. Look at how shiny. Stop hitting me. I want to look at the shiny boy. He was so shiny. <laughs> okay, that's enough. That's enough. That, ow! Hey, yo. Okay, that's enough. How do I fight you again? <laughs> Ew. No, no. Why am I using a club? Okay. No, listen! Get off your shiny horse! It's not a high horse anymore, it's just shiny now. Ow. Wait a minute. Oh, damn it. I didn't swap... I didn't swap X and Y, and I was still backwards. Okay, fine. We can, we can deal with it. <laughs> this is the... This is... Yeah, this is the... The... Detective Pikachu treatment. Everything looks wrong now. Oh no. Shiny, shiny world. Give me that. Don't shame them for being shiny. I mean, okay, you know what? There's nothing wrong with being shiny. You're right. Especially not if you're Tamatoa. He likes being shiny, doesn't he? What's happening? Where am I? Where's this guy? Get off. Whoa! Uh, all right, we're done. We're done here. I'm out. Uh, where the hell is... Wait. We want to go... This way. Is that their horse? Can I take their horse? Would you please? Oh, wait. I think you do this, right? Does that do anything? Not really. Hello? It's really hard to see what the hell is going on when you're in first person. I will say this. Horse! Give me you! Okay, come on! Ho ho! Ho ho! Ho ho! Okay. Just for now. Ow! Wait, I'm rolling. Link. Why? I can't believe you've done this. Okay, we'll just bail. Mm. Mm. Am I playing it on the Switch? No, I'm not. <laughs> the Switch would not be be capable of of pushing this this kind of look at that kind of graphical fidelity. Pretty, very pretty. All right, let's make our way to the city, Kakariko Village. <laughs> right off a cliff in first person. Wait! There's a little... <laughs> oh. <laughs> There's a little shrine here. Did I ever get this one? Kumagnitai. I have no idea if I ever got this one in my game. I just found a little shrine. It's in the middle of nowhere. Oh! I should... Okay, you know what? Let's turn, let's turn the cell shading back on, just because it looks nicer. There. Skip, please. All right, I'm good. I'm, I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to unlock it so I can teleport here. Hmm? Can you ride a goat? I don't think so. I don't know. Maybe. I would be, I would be okay with riding a goat. Yup. 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 Is that what it's supposed to be? Wait, is that what it's supposed to be? X, Y, no. X is, wait, X, Y, X is, Y. 
Hang on. Let me switch these controls while I'm here anyway. Input settings. Uh, Xbox controller. Yeah, this is it. X is... X is... Y. No, X is... Wait, what? X is X, right? Is that the way it is? Let me load my... This. X is Y. Is that... Is that how it works? Is X, Y, and X... I don't know. Let me look at my, my other controller. Let me close this out. Oh, yeah. See, this is what's the annoying part about... About wind or like every other every other PC controller and the 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 Nintendo controllers is that the X and the Y buttons and you can't see that in the little camera but A and B and X and Y are swapped places it's very confusing so I need to swap X and Y that's what I need to do input settings X why does it say left alt no no X can I not do that on the fly Oh, maybe I have to, maybe I have to not be in a game to do that. X, X, yeah, I can't do that. Dang it. All right, I'll do that later then. We'll have to play, we'll have to live with it for now. Anyway. Yeah, you have to shut the game down. Oh, wait, the cell shading. Thank you. It's a weird, though, that I guess, I mean, to be fair, it's not Nintendo that swapped. It's everyone else that swapped them around, because Nintendo was first with the Super Nintendo. And then along comes Microsoft, swapping buttons around. Where am I? Why am I here? Have I gone the wrong way? Why is there palm tree? Where am I? I'll be fine. Maybe. <sighs> NES? Well, NES didn't have four buttons, though. NES just had A and B side by side next to each other. So that doesn't... N the SNES was the first controller that had the four buttons in the current arrangement that they've stuck with since. Whoa! Hello! Dude, you look kind of cool. Whoa! You look badass. All right, peace out. Don't kill me, though. I got places to do and things to be. Everything is so big. It's very dark in here. Everything is super big. When you're a tiny little Link person, the world is 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 huge. Don't do that. But it's also very nice. Very shiny, shiny world. They really nail the atmosphere, though. Even even from a first-person perspective like this, it feels like like a, a giant open world for you to explore. It's really cool. Don't toot your horn at me. I'm gonna go... Where am I? Where the hell am I in the world? Let me just look at the map real quick. Oh, yeah. Maybe I should just teleport. Nah. Nah, we can manage. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I could also, just for just for comparison, I guess I could shut down the game and switch off first person just for a little bit. Once we've once we've uh, seen the things I want to see, just see what it looks like, see what it runs like. I wonder if it runs worse in third person because technically there's a whole character less now because there's no character player character. Oh, shut. I guess it doesn't, because now you can see the whole character. Don't! Oh, it's close. No, we haven't seen a dragon yet. Not yet. We've just, just gotten a horse, really. That's all I've done so far. I want to see the Korok Forest. I want to see Kakariko Village. I kind of want to see Hateno Village as well, because that's where you live when you're buying your house, right? I want to see those things. I just want to go on a sightseeing journey. And then after that, maybe we should just go to the castle and take a, take a peek at Mr. Dorf himself. Because probably I could. It's going to be tricky to get there, though. Not because I'll die, but because I'll, I'll be knocked around by the lasers a lot. 
But we could try. Like, I can't climb too well if I get shot down all the time. But we'll try. Uh, I want to see Bolson. Yeah, me too. Uh, where am I going? This way. Yup. Yup. Thanks, chat. Bleed purple 100 bonus 10 random question. Do you like tattoos or want to get one? If so, what would you get? <laughs> Justin, why do you say things sometimes really weird? Also, Halo, thank you. Um, I do like tattoos. Mostly on other people, though. I don't know if I would... If a tattoo would suit me. I tend to like tattoos and piercings a lot on other people. But I don't know if... If I would pull it off. However, I do have plans. Or if I were to get tattoos or a tattoo... I do have two tattoos planned uh, on either inner lower arm. Basically, the same spots where uh, Sean has his tattoos, like under under there. Um, I want to get one on my right arm that is just the uh, Deathly Hallows triangle symbol thing. And just like, I don't, I don't want any colored. I just want them black in that case. So I wanted to get that on my, on one of my arms. And then I wanted to get on my other, on my left inner arm, I wanted to get the, uh, just my cube head. My cube head logo kind of thing. Outlined kind of thing. The thing that it's, that's on the t-shirts basically. I wanted to get those at some point. But I'm kind of like, both... Both kind of cheap when it comes to, like, actually doing it and paying money for it. And also a little bit, like, I don't want to have to take care of that. If I, like, you gotta put cream on it. You can't, like, suntan. Because it's got to heal. It's like, I, I don't, I just don't want to think about things. I mean, it's only for the beginning and it's not like it's difficult, but... I know. I don't know if it's worth it. Yup. 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 Temporary tattoo sticker. <laughs> Maybe I should just get get those instead. Yeah. Or draw on myself with a sharpie. I think that's a good thing to do if you're planning on getting a tattoo. Just draw the thing you might want to get. Just draw it on with like a permanent marker first. And see if you and uh, see if you still like the way it looks after like a week. Yeah, hey, why not? See if you get comfortable with it. You know, like yeah, I, I like where this uh, where this is and how it looks on me on my skin, even still. Yeah, haha. -ha. Once you get one, it's hard to stop. Yeah, I've heard that too. I don't feel like I would have a problem not getting more tattoos, but then again, I also don't have any. So maybe that's just my ignorance speaking. Maybe I would, maybe I would have an issue with it. Later. Oh shit. We're good. Yeah. Just don't go outside. I mean, I rarely, ah, oh, pretty. I rarely do anyway, but I like having the option. Well, anyway, we're heading off. I want to get... Ooh, wait, can I... Where was it? Where, where... Oh, cool. Where would be a good place for a dragon? I guess we could just climb the ice mountain, really. It's not like I can freeze to death. I can just go there. And just look at the dragon. We could do that. Speaking of, Frost Dragon. F frost Death Dragon. Thank you for the 11 month reset. <sighs> usually mountains? Yeah, usually. You can just go up on the ice on. What is it called? Mount. Kakariko? Ahu? 
Hey, Waikiki. You know the mountain. Yep. Do I draw as in pencil to paper? Uh, no, I don't really. I did when I was younger. I, I, I guess that's how I, well, also because when I was younger, it was the 90s. So it's not like you could really do a lot of 3D from home back then. But I did when I was a kid. I tend to, I tend to draw things back then. I remember I drew the thing. I, I didn't draw a lot of like, I didn't draw a lot of comic, like as in cartoon looking characters. I drew, I drew a lot of more realistic people, portraits kind of things. And I remember that I drew when the first Pirates of the Caribbean Car Caribbean movie came out, I drew a, a, a Jack Sparrow portrait that that was was good, according to my mom. Anyway, Kakariko Village! Ah, yeah. This is super nice. I would totally live here. No, I want to live in Hateno Village. I think I, I think Hateno is nicer. This is too enclosed within mountains, but still. I guess it makes it less windy. Oh yeah, we should go talk to Isma though. Alright, let's do that. Let's go talk. Wait. Oh shit, wait. <laughs> Guys, don't worry about it. I'm nice. Don't I need like a hundred bucks as well for the fair, for the fountain? Okay, let me go sell some stuff so I can get a hundred dollars real fast, so we can go up there. I would totally live in Terrytown. It's true. Oh shit! Look, it goes third person when you're in here. Oh, I guess that makes sense because it's too cramped of a space. Otherwise, you you wouldn't see where the hell you are. Fair ah. enough. Hello. Uh, this is, this is a healthy animals, but is locally grown fresh fruit top to grand recipe. Come on, grab one. Oh, you're here for something else. I want to sell. What are you selling? I'm selling my shaft. How would you like my shaft? Uh, you know what? I'm just going to sell. I'm just going to sell all of this crap. Why not? I just need a hundred bucks, really. Hmm. -hmm. This whole game is pretty. It really is. Even even on the Switch at a 720p resolution, it is still a very pretty game. They did a they did a, a perfect job with uh, art art direction of this game. I think. <laughs> Look at Mike putting his belly out. Suck in that belly. Uh, bye. Peace. All right, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna talk to Isma, and then I'm gonna go, and then I'm gonna talk to Fairy. Then I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go somewhere else. Yeah. Wait, let me just also do- No, no. Uh, that. Don't be scared just because I pulled out my sword, okay? What's up? How are you? Lady Isma is here. Hmm, you're a cool guy. Okay, you can go in, I guess. That's me. Hmm? You never noticed the cobbling gods moving? See? Benefits of high resolution. Yeah, there's a lot of little things like that. See you later. <gasps> oh, shy girl. Hey. <laughs> a man. Paya. Oh, is that a Sheikah site? Yeah, it is. I'm the cool guy. Yep. Well, uh, m uh, m Mike. It's me. All right. All right. Stop talking. I want to pew. God, I got it out. You did it. You did a good job. Mm, you're very nervous. I just want to look at you real close, okay? Like awkwardly close. Dude, we're almost the same height. For once, a person that isn't giant. Hooray! All right. I want to go in here though. No, no, no. We're done. Don't worry about it. I won't disturb you anymore. You're finally awake.
It has been quite a long time, Link. I am much older now, but you remember me, don't you? I think I did a better job at voice acting that character than, than this voice. What? Huh? Uh, what's the matter about the lack of familiar? That yeah, I've forgotten everything, dude. Jesus, don't you know? Oh, oh, <laughs> you've lost your memory. Mm, matters not. Dearest Link, please come a bit closer. Mm. There's no shading. Oh, look. Let's look at the mic with no shirt on and no shading. It's gonna be so wet, and moist, moist mic back in action. Let's do it. All right, all right. Yep, 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 yep. Hundred years. Prince's message. However, mm, she risked her life. Mm. Yeah. Do you think she was always that tiny? Do you think she, when she was like young, she was still like a like a you know like a type of character? What's her name? Edna Mode type of character? I feel like. All right. Let's remove everything. Let's remove that. We'll remove that. We'll remove that. And then. Will remove the cell shading. Oh yeah, it's there. Bam, bam, bam. What does that do? Oh, it just fixes some shadows. Weird. Huh. Bam. <laughs> oh, no. It feels more indecent. It makes it feel worse. I kind of don't approve. <laughs> oh, you have a head under there. Look at that. Oh, she's got a little, she's got a hair mitt. Your hair is very shiny. Look, she's got a little compartment for her her head buns under there. Oh, that's adorable. All right, you know what? I'm gonna turn. Actually, I'm gonna leave first. Can I do that? Peace. I wanna look, okay, well, the world itself doesn't look that different. It's mainly the characters that kind of look gross and weird and moist. I'm gonna turn the cell shading back on because I don't like it. There you go. Now jump in the water, get even more moist. Hello! I wanna go to. Uh, no. Oh, maybe I should put some clothes on. Or maybe I shouldn't. There's no reason. I don't freeze. Uh, I wanna go. <laughs> the Xenoblades Chronicles! It's still there. Uh, Hateno Village. Oh shit, I haven't... It's like somewhere around here, right? Ah, maybe we should just... Oops. Maybe I should just talk to... to the lady first. Actually get going. No clothes? Maybe not. I think, yeah. She was really enthusiastic with her, uh... With her conditioner. She made it real... She made it real shiny. I guess I can see why. It's still like... Because you need that little... Like... It's so shiny because you need to to enhance when the cell shading is on. You need to see these type of specular type of specular uh, reflections happening. So they have to make it overly shiny so that those stand out. It's kind of an interesting way of, of looking at how the game is is made. Uh, I am prepared to risk my life. Yeah, can't you tell by my outfit? Mm hmm. Not a memory to your name. I haven't changed a bit. Once a hero, always a hero. Very well. Since you've lost your memory, I will recount for you what happened. Oh no. The history of the royal family. Real cool. I mean, we've done that. We don't need to see that again. What was that fart? Yeah. In preparation for a foretold revival, but in the end, despite our best efforts, we under in order to avoid ever making the grave mistake ever free the divine beast. Got it. 
<laughs> I did it. Uh... All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. I'm the cool guy. Oh, phew. Lucky we have cell shading on for this shot. Too much skin. Hateno Village. No. Oh yeah. Okay. Yep. 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 A plus voice acting. Thanks. I tried really hard. Alright, I'm gonna go there now. Peace. I also... Whoa! Awkward. Dude, did you see... Did you see how she looked at me? She says embarrassed. Her mouth says embarrassed. Her eyes say... Hell yeah, Mike. Give me some of that. Uh, wait. Fairy fountain first. <laughs> do we want to? Do we want to start this? I don't like how they follow me through there. Stop. Do we want to start the hide and seek again, like I did last time, and then never go look for for, for the lady, for the kid? We'll just start. Yeah, 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 totally. Let's go play hide and seek. And then just bail. Never go find them. No. Too rude. Mike is nice. Unless it's towards the king. Then not so much. Because he teased us. Glide teased us. It really felt like, yeah. Come play with us, Mike. Play with us, Mikey. No. You know what? No means no. I'm gonna say no. Oh, oh. Ooh, fairies. Actually, I don't need them. I can't die. Well, I still want them. This is cool. Look at how this looks now. It's so big and intimidating. Fairy! Bam. Dang it, that's not what I wanted. Fairy, 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 Take the fairy! There you go. I don't think we're gonna be able to see the actual fairy in first person though, because it's gonna go third person when we talk, but. Do we get to see the hand? Oh no, okay. Oh. Oh. At least we're gonna see them in high resolution. Please, listen to my story. Sure. I'm the great fairy Cotera. This place was once a beautiful spring, but as time passed, few and fewer travelers arrived to offer me rupees. I lost my power. I'm nearly powerless now. I beg you, all I need is a hundred rupees. Okay. Duh. Here we go. In order for me to regain my powers, I need a hundred rupees. Bam, baby. You got it. Oh, thank you. You are too kind. What does she do with them? I mean, it's... It's pretty looking. Oh! I'm trying to decide if the higher resolution is a benefit or a detriment. Oh, I like it. Oh, what a feeling. The first breath of fresh air after an eternity of decay. 10,000 years, such a crack in the boob. And as they say, one good turn... One good turn deserves another? Deed, no? Allow me to enhance your clothing. Excuse me, what clothing? I don't use those things. They're, I'm, I'm above them. No thanks. Going already? How unfortunate. <laughs> Forgot how creepy they were. Yeah, they're a little bit, a little bit special. Back away slowly, Mike. Just back away. Do oh. Do do do.
I do like that song, though. All right, we did it. Um, ferry done. Now we go to Hateno, and then we travel to a wa -we -wa -we Korok Forest. I don't know where that is, but we'll figure it out. At least we can perpetually... Oh, oh yeah! I never did this in my other game, did I? I never got her ball. Or did I? I don't remember. Why collect fairies? Because I don't like when they're free! They need to be contained! Alright. Uh, I'm gonna go up really, really, really high. And then I'm gonna really, really, really fly. Because I'm that kind of, kind of, kind of guy. And also, I don't have stamina, so I can just fly forever. It's gonna be great. Why? Why what? What? Why what? I do nothing bad, ever. I'm Spider-Man now. Yup! Forever, yup! Come on, Mike. You do it. Yup! 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 All right, now, man, this is like the best way of, of oh, this is to totally a yahaha, right? Yeah. yeah, I did find you. Sounds weird. It sounds like I'm, I should be looking at the subscriber list. Oh. All right. Uh, Hatano, I can see it from here. It's right there. I'm going there. And a one, and a two, and a yoop! Hmm. Yeah, right, it just feels like a notification now that I'm missing something. Why didn't that show up in the... Oh, wait. It was a real yaw. I wish that you could cheat an updraft. There's another Yahaha right there. So that you could just like press a button and you just like shoot up in the up in the air a little bit more. Like a like a, a Revali's Gale now. I'd like to do that. So I don't have to land. Like a pleb. I know boo! 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 I know I'm a loser. I can't even fly properly. Alright. No, you can't do it. Uh, you can't do that in midair, Rivali's Gale thing. You have to like, you have to hold the jump button and like do the crouchy Superman pose, Neo pose. You have to Neo the shit out of here, so that the the, <laughs> the ground does that kind of wave that it does in Matrix Two. It's kind of cool looking. I wonder, by the way. Let me just try the Pro HUD. Oh, you gotta restart. Dang it. Alright, fine. I do wonder if cheating Rivali's Gale lets me just use it, or if I still have to go beat him to get it. I'm gonna assume that I still have to go actually beat him to unlock the ability at all. Hmm? A little bit lame here. A little bit. But we can live with it. Hey, stoned. What's up? Look, I'm high resolution, high frame rate mic. Let me see if... I don't know what this means. Divine Laser Beams Customizer. All customization of the... Allows customization of the color of the Divine Beast Laser Beam. They can also be completely hidden. Wow. Uh, I don't want that, though. I want to cheat, and I want to put on Infinite Revali's Gale. Yeah, no, I can't use it. I have to actually unlock it first. Fair enough. I mean, it makes sense, because I don't have the actual ability. So, I can't have infinite of something that I don't have. I guess you always have infinite of something you don't have. Because you don't have it, so you have infinite of not it. Is that how it works? 
Like, I don't have any gold. Does that mean I have Shh, infinite no gold? Blee Purple 2000 bonus 200 thanks for helping me feel better today. Mike is just what I needed. <laughs> Mike is usually what most people need, even if they don't realize it. But thanks, Carrie Berry. I'm glad you're feeling a little bit better. That's deep. <laughs> is it though? Is it deep or is it stupid? They're closely interlinked, those two. Hey, birds. Do you wish to die? Do you wish to perish? Oh, lucky you didn't. Lucky I didn't have a weapon equipped then. All right. Can I open the map? I could. But does it matter? <gasps> There's nothing. Oh, why did I put that? Oh, yeah, that was a uh, mistake. Where is this tower at, by the way? Oh, it's right there. Ah, might as well. They did escape. For now. It was a warning anyway. They'll tell their friends all about what didn't happen here on this day. Okay, I'm gonna get that. I'm gonna go to the village. And then, we're gonna beeline it straight for Korok Forest. Because I want to look at the Master Sword before we have to end for the day. Oh, man, I keep I keep being worried that I'm going to die. Why can't I? Why do you wor worry? Why do you have to be worried? It's just immortal. All right, we'll go up here. It'll be real quick because I can climb forever. Don't worry about it. Can you turn off the blood moon? Uh, would that, wouldn't that mean that you would clear the game of enemies if no enemies ever come back? No, you can't. I mean, maybe you could potentially, but there's no option for it. So unless you learn how to mod the game yourself, then no. Potentially, I feel like you should be able to do it if, if you just sort of... Because I'm assuming that the game has sort of a cycle. Uh, of, 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 like, what is it? Like a three-day cycle for when the Blood Moon shows up. So if you just make it so that you reset the cycle every morning, then every morning will be the morning of the first day. So then you won't have any monsters ever. <laughs> Once you've cleared the map of, of monsters, you won't ever have a new monster ever show up ever again. It would be like, dude, you should totally do that. Like, after you beat Ganon the first time, you should just do that. So it will it'll be like you uh, you won and you play like you can play post game. Why not? Sounds like Majora's map. Kinda does, doesn't it? The dawn of the first day. Don't spike yourself, okay? Hacks? There's no hacks around here. We don't believe in hacks. Wait. Oh, no, we're good. There you go. Oh. I feel so unprotected for some reason. Ah. Button ready. Oh. Button ready. Hole in one. Hole in one. In a minute now. Oh. So it's... Now. Hole in one! It's after two doo 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 after it cuts to the close-up. Kind of. Yeah? I did something at least. <laughs> um, okay, where the hell is... Do, 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 do. Sheikah's Lake updated. Hmm, fantastic. Searching for shrines. Oh, wow. No, I don't want to do that, thank you. I can enable it. Yeah, I know. Hmm. I want to... Um... Why can't I see the back of Mike's teeth? No! Please! Help. Help, I'm stuck in my head. 
Oh, phew. Okay, we did it. We survived. Um, so, I, where is... The forest is, like, up here, isn't it? Or is it, or is it here? No, that's the castle. It's up here, isn't it? Is it? Is it that far up? Or is it here? Is it here? I'm gonna set a thing. Wait. No. It'll be there. I wanna set a marker for like a general location of the forest. I think it's around here, right? Let's just set a thing then. Alright, off I go. Wait. No, off I go. A dentist's dream? I guess so. I guess it would be easier. Wait, is my Sheikah sensor thingy on? How do I Thanks, Jack. Hey, Robin. Hey, what's up? Orientation for my new job ended earlier than I thought. I see we are playing Mike Smile. 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 We are, coffee beans. But we're playing it first person mode. Because we can. Because we're weird today. Hmm. All right. This is, well, not the optimal moment. Maybe we should wait. Can I just find a fire and wait? Oh, it got so dark. Hello? Spooky. <laughs> yeah, it got real spooky real fast. This is pretty, though. Yikes, help! Nah. I'm good. It's like coming home after a long adventure. Hey, everybody! Hateno Village. Woo! Don't woo me! Who are you? I'm naked. Mm hmm. You certainly do appear to be naked. Hmm. Well, you're free to go. Bye! Yeah, got it. Peace. Uh, oh, dang it. No! <laughs> I just came. Ah, well. Link. Speaking of. Link. Yeah, what is it? What's up? Be on your guard. Oh, okay. Mate. Mata. Rises to its peak under the hour of the blood moon. By its glow, the aimless spirits of monsters slain in the name of the light return to flesh. Link. Please be careful. Okay. <laughs> yeah, British Zelda. For some reason. Okay, at least we got to see that. That was kind of fun. Yeah, I prefer the Japanese voices as well. But we made it here. We're in Hateno. I know. Oh. Peaceful. Wait, that's no Blood Moon. Cheats! Hacks! No! Dang it. Wait, can we wait here? I want to wait until... Uh, I want to wait until daytime. Come on. Faster, 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 Stop! Sit until noon. Well, sit until noon, please. Mm -hmm. No, I'm not going to play the whole game again. We're basically just doing this bit, and then going to the forest, and then that's about... Well, and then I'm going to go into Ganon. Just because I'm immortal. Just to sort of look at it. Look at him for a little bit. Maybe we can defeat him and just win the game outright. Ah, here we go. Oi! Hello! Oh, the gossip ladies. Hey, have you heard? The dying factory. We're home. Yeah. Home sweet home. This definitely feels so home when you get to this point, I think. Especially after having played the game 
not that long ago, all the way through, you spend so much time going back here. So, so nice. So nice to get to see it like this. Hey, little child. Oh, you're so tiny. Mumble, mumble. I guess I gotta bring the fire all the way up into uh, up to to the lab. Realistically, but maybe not now. Yeah, I'm gonna go see the house as well. I just want to go up to the lab and then I'm gonna fly down over the town just to get a bird's eye view. Uh, back to the house. That's my plan. <laughs> Maybe I should do the fire bit, because it's not raining for one. Hang on, do I have a stick? I do! Okay, wait. Isn't the fire, like, right around here somewhere? There. It's right there. I'm gonna bring some fire with me. It's actually a lot of... It's, lot, it's, it's disorienting when it's first person, because you're so close to the ground. It's, it's hard to, to see where you are. But I kind of like it. I kind of like that it adds a little bit of, like, mystery to the world, in a sense, again. Yeah. Oh, wait. Is that rain clouds? Nope. Is the game- does the game do that? Does the game know that I'm close to a, a fire source and it's like, oh, he's gonna do the, the blue fire pit now. Let's rain on his parade! I feel like the game does that deliberately. I feel like it is, yeah. It's when the, when the sun when the sun goes away, it's like oh, no, nope. no rain. Not yet. It's kind of tricky to know if you're actually holding. Well, I guess the shadow is telling, but Hup. why don't you jump? Good. Jump, will you? Jump, will you? Jump. Jump to the base. <laughs> Okay, fine. Let's do it like this. Wait! My weapons don't break! This should last forever! I don't think it's gonna break from... fire either. Or is it? Can I throw it? Why do I throw it? Do I have it still? Ow, oh, Mike! I feel- maybe it is an infinite- let me actually- okay, let's put this theory to the test. For these bits, yeah, being able to switch between first and third person kind of help. I guess you can hear the fire sound. I'm just gonna run. I'm just gonna go for it. I think it might last forever. I think it may. I think it may, I think it may. I think I can, I think I can. OP! OP fire run. Swing! Olympic torch coming through! Beep beep. So... That means that you could potentially... If you put on this cheat... You could beat Ganon with like a stick or like a mop because you can get a mop as a weapon oh they do break from fire after all dang it so you could get a stick and you could or a mop and beat ganon with that because they don't lose durability interesting kind of fun hey kid what's up Yeah, dang it. Dang it. So close. Wait, did I do this all day? Is it already going nighttime again? Shwing! Mm. Poke him to death. Yeah, just poke him with a mop until he dies.
I do think, though, that if you pull it, uh, if you put the, the torch away and then bring it back out, it resets for some reason. So, I mean, I'm just gonna do that instead. So, if I do this. Boop! Did I take it away? Yeah. There. Solved it. Man, it hasn't started raining or anything. Mop the floor with him. Exactly. Mop, mop, take out the trash. Mop the floor with Ganon. Dar. Uh oh. Look at that sun. So gorgeous. The colors in this game. How do they do it? It's pretty. Nintendo, man. Yeah? It's like they know what they're doing. Do it. No, no. No, no. There you go. <laughs> watch, watch National Geographic. Hey, oh, wait, isn't there a, there's a thing on Netflix now that I haven't seen. Our Planet, I wanna watch that. Have you seen, if you haven't seen BBC's um, Planet Earth, season two. Try to go find and watch that. Because Planet Earth Season 2 is the prettiest nature documentary thing ever. It's amazing. Wait, where am I? Where's the next torch? Hmm? Planet Earth Earth uh, Planet Earth Season 1 is was amazing when it when it came out but by now it's a little bit like because it's mostly lockdown shots and static shots it's still good but it's not as good but for season two they use like a bunch of like drones and time lapses and it's all like 4k it's so pretty it's so good there's like a shot i think in season two where they where they do a pan not just a pan, but they do like a... They spin the camera around a mushroom, like, around it, as the mushroom is growing in a time-lapse. It's crazy. It's really good. It's just like a... It's like... It's like the opposite of the Matrix. Because they do it... They spin the camera around in slow... When... During slow motion. But they do that, but for time-lapse. Like stuff like that you haven't seen before. It's like just whoa. I think there was a there's a clip. Uh, there's usually clips at the end of the episodes where they talk about how they did that specific episode. There's one episode where they shot uh, an eagle in the mountains uh, or eagles in the mountains fighting over food, and the guy. I think the guy had spent like a hundred hours in a sh in like a in like a cover a shed to get that shot. Jesus, man. Better be worth it. Anyway, we did it! Unlock Hot Tan Old Village. I'm not gonna go in and do all that for now, though. Uh, or should I? Just to unlock it. Let's do it. Boop. Dedication. Oh, yeah. Hello! Oh, yeah, I forgot. I'm not wearing anything. Linky! Is it really you? Yeah, unfortunately. Uh, the Guardian Stone is working again. I did that. Yeah, I did it. I'm pretty good at that. I'm pretty good at doing things. Anyway. Are you gonna talk about- I just kind of wanted to see you in- <laughs> This majestic pose. Every time. Anyway. I wish I could skip this. Can I skip this? No. Look, I just wanted to get the camera mode, okay? Can I get my camera mode? Oh, shit, lost all- Sorry! Yeah. Are you a child? I'm sorry! I literally had no other option. Truth is, I look this way because of a failed experiment. Do you think the thing in her hair used to be her bra? When she was an adult? With the little blue lights? The little nipple lights? Maybe. Kind of look like, you know, like a Xena kind of thing. Or like a Zelda prisoner kind of thing. 
I mean, uh, uh, not, uh, what's her name? Leia. You know? Kind of. Maybe. Maybe she was Madonna. Maybe. <gasps> A little bit, a little bit too late. Instantly render a visible image into a picture. Wow. Maybe she used them as blinkers, you know, indicators. I'm turning left now. Her left boob. I would do that. Just saying. Anyway, I'm out. <laughs> let me get- let me go! <laughs> I want to go to the forest! Yeah, it's all fixed up. Let me take a picture of you first, shall I? Oh, oh. Compendium, album, camera, looks good. So, I know it's a sudden, but hear me out. Hi. Take a picture of me. Okay. Camera mode. Click. Okay. Look cool, okay? Perfect. Yep. And... Oh, dang it! <laughs> no. <sighs> Fine, I'll take your picture. I'll take it. No, not the feet. For wiki feet? <laughs> that doesn't count because it doesn't say her name. Wait, if I do this... There! It counts! No, it doesn't count. Alright. Mm-hmm. That doesn't count either? Oh yeah, it should count, right? How's the picture taking going? Oh yeah, I did one. I did a good, uh, good one of your head eyes. Let me see it. Perfect. Who is this beautiful young creature? Mm. Yep. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, yeah, 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 yeah. Let me go. I just want to leave this place. The lost memory. Some piece missing memory. She knows more. Oh yeah, one more thing. Here's the iPhone 11. All right, anyway. Peace. I'm out. Ooh, ooh. Finally. Now we go to the forest. But first we fly. Ooh. Why is there no skip dialogue? Yeah, right. Well, we did it. We did something. I wish it was daytime, but still. It's nice to see it. This music makes me makes me feel home. Well, let's go up and uh, check out my house as well. Well, to be house. Ooh! Hey, uh, an infinite rupees cheat. That would be nice. Just so I could buy the house. Oh well, I guess in, I guess I need to make or gather up like. 4,000 pieces of wood as well, don't I? Anyway, it's night again. Uh, so, okay, so Bolson and, and Hudson and whatever, they're not going to be there until the daytime, so I'm going to sit till noon. Hmm. Infinite wood cheats. Yeah, kind of. It's kind of what we need. Infinite wood and infinite rupees. If I could have that, that would be nice. Are they there? We can go in the house, though, because there's no door. <laughs> yeah! We just can't uh, furnish it or buy it yet. Oh, wait. Home. Home. Almost home. 
This is where we live. In the future. Wait, hang on. This is where we sleep. In the future. Oh, Mike. You're gonna have such... Hey, wait! Don't smack my wall down, okay? I'm gonna go talk to your superior, but... <laughs> hey! The head man! Alright, wait. You. You are the one. You're the one I need. Oh. Whoa! Aren't you perky? Well then. Need something from me? What are you doing? In the case, it's not obvious. I'm demolishing a vacant house. Times are off. Not a lot of buyers, you know. Mm, so the villagers decided it were best to just tear it down. I can buy it. Oh. Whoa, get a load of young money bags. Just wants to buy it, huh? Okie do. Let me lay it out for you. See, this house been vacant for years, so the villagers had a meeting and argued, vote, and decided to tear it down. Demolition costs with associated fees and permits and 50,000 rupees. So, when you say buy it, you're talking about 50,000 rupees. You got that much? I'll pay. Wow, who'd have thought? Let him go get her, aren't you? Well, reminds me of me back in the day. All right. All right, look. Here's the deal, just for you. I'll cut you a deal of 3,000 rupees, but in return, I'm gonna need you to bring me 30 wood bundles. Of course. Of course. Well. Hi. Hi. There you go. Don't smack my house anymore. I'm gonna get it later on. Not now, though. Can't afford it. It's so green out here. Alright, let's go to the fort. Can I teleport to anywhere close-ish? Kind of? You're impressed by how pretty this game is? Yeah. It's very nice. I wish that... I wish that Nintendo... Well... You never know. I wish that the next, or I hope that the next Nintendo console is higher resolution so that their games can look pretty. I mean, they still do, but, you know, prettier. I get that their focus is like gameplay and a cool experience in terms of adventure, but you could also make it look really good if you really want it. Just saying. All right, forest, 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 forest. We need to go over there. We need to go long. A realistic Mario. I mean, not necessarily realistic, just like, you know, 4K potential. Because even though, even though their games aren't necessarily photorealistic, it would still be nice to see them not look pixelated to crap. What is that? Man, I wish I had Rivali's Gale. Is that a... Is that a... Uh... Is that a... Star? Oh, it is! It's a star! It's a star! It's a fragment of star! Where is it? It's so big! What is that? No, that is totally a star. Where is it? What is that? Or is that the... Dragon? No... Oh! Well, it's gone now. This is cozy. The rain. Mm -hmm. Where did it go? I think it was a, a star fragment, and they uh, go out. Oh, okay. Don't see me. Don't do it. 
Okay, we're good. Oh. Yeah, it wasn't a star, but it was something really cool. What was it? Was it the dragon? No, it wasn't a dragon. Something else. Magic and mystery. Maybe that was the Xenoblade quest that I keep having for some reason. Hut. 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 Revali's Gale, please. Okay, I know what I'm doing first, first and foremost. It's not really kosher for Mike. I mean, no, I think Mike. Okay, listen. Here's my head cannon. Mike has cast. Mike is part of. Okay, this is part of the Magic 2.0 book series by Scott Meyer. And in that series, the main characters, they find a computer file. They find a file on a, a, a server and they open this file and they realize that this file has data on everyone in the world. And the main character, he looks himself up and he finds his own data, he finds his own height, and width, and weight, and every every piece of information about himself. And they start to edit this file. And those edits become real. So, they edit their files so that they're always, no matter where they are, or what they're doing, their files are locked to always be a comfortable Temp at a comfortable temperature and at a comfortable like um, well just comfortable so no matter where they go or what they do uh, or what they're wearing they're always comfortable because they've locked their own files to always be comfortable I'm gonna say that this is part of that canon and that Mike is always comfortable no matter what hmm. that was my explanation even in a volcano or space? Yes, even in a volcano or space. However, they, while they don't need to eat or breathe, uh, they did never figure out how to make it feel like you don't need to eat or breathe. So basically, if you don't eat or breathe, uh, you're gonna forever feel like you're starving to death and suffocating. So they still need to eat or breathe to just not feel like that. Even if they don't eat or breathe, they won't die, but they'll just feel like that forever. So that's fun. Yeah. I mean, it's better than dying, I suppose. But it's a good book series. If you have Audible, I recommend Magic 2.0. There are five books. The first two are the best. Three is pretty good. Four and five, eh, not so much, but not bad. Do, 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 do. Where the hell am I? Where the hell is the forest? That's all, I'm, that's all I want. Oh. And this is pretty. Why is this extra pretty? Maybe it's just the weather and the light and the grass. Oh, whoops. No, I want to smack you. Smack it. Smack it? Bomb it. No, no. Bomb. <laughs> Perfect. No! <laughs> all my gems! Ah, they went all over the place. Dang it. Uh, all right, forest, forest, forest. Ah, there it is. This is, oh, hey, look. Burp, burp, burp. The, the pink tree over there, that's where we're going. Do, 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 do. <laughs> I don't need them. I do if, oh. I do if I wanna buy the house at some point. Though. What is this? Look, there's like a little hole here. Ah, uh, hello. So I'm just visiting, or am I? Nope, nope, I'm out. Peace. Oh, I didn't mean to. 
stupid tantalizing hole. Ah, don't present me with a hole I can't go with. Dang it. <laughs> Mike slap your little feet. This time there's zero. Yeah, well, this time I, I there I feel like I don't know if this counts towards towards not dying because I can't. Well, no, that's not true. We did die once because we fell off the plateau. Well, jumped off the plateau, and that did kill us. Man, this is a trek and a half. Can I get that tower? Hut. Yeah, we did. Even though I'm immortal, I did manage to die. Why is there stuff on it? What is on top of that tower? It's like a little, wearing a little hat. What is that? Is it just goo? Let's we'll see. Maybe it is goo. Yeah, it's probably goo. Most things in this in this world is goo. Man, it becomes so dark. Hello? The ro rock skull? Is it? Maybe. Oh no! Wait, it's raining. <gasps> no, we're fine. Spit, 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 spit. Whoa! Shit! Military training camp. Oh, I know which tower. Okay, no, I remember now. Yeah, 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 I know which tower this is. Oh. It's really scary to jump off. Oh, there's a bunch of sleeping people. It's kind of scary to jump off ledges when you can't see yourself. Because I'm not sure if I'm actually pulling the glider out or not. Yet. Hey, I got bits to give and I might fall asleep soon. Always love your stream smile. What? Oh, tar. Not water. Got it. Psycho kid, thank you. I drowned! Dang it! Immortal man! Well, maybe that was for the better though. Could you imagine sinking in tar? and being immortal. You would never, ever, ever be able to get out, but you also wouldn't ever be able to die. You'd just be there. Forever. Uh oh Wait, I can do this, right? Oh! Mama, oh, mama! Oh, dang it. Yeah. Dang it. I need to get there, but it's tricky because... I'm dumb. Don't laugh at me. Why? Just grab the, grab the ledge. Uh, the temperature is getting very high. I wonder why. All right, let's do that. Wait, no! Damn it. Stop. 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 Okay, you know what? Uh, well, first of all, you need to go away. Go! Scrap! You? No, no. Well, I guess you also. Uh, no. I want a bow. Arrows, bow, please. I want you. Where'd you go? Where? I want you. Just scrap! Scrap! Dang it. Where am I? Oh, this is tricky. This is a d battle for the ages. Shoot! Dang it. Where? Where? Shoot! Not that one. Well, I guess that one. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Any minute now. Bam! Well, that didn't work really. Did it? I need a uh, ice arrow, but I don't have ice arrow. So I can't do it, okay? Well, I can, but it's just gonna take four years. Bam! Peace! <laughs> that works. Let's just stick with that. I should be able to climb this though, right? Eh. Yeah. 
Is it just gonna rain down fire and brainstone forever? Is this just my life now? Is this just what's happened to me as a mic? Is this just what, what what happens? Am I just stuck for forever in this hell? <gasps> my! This is hard in first person. Just say. Alright. Alright, we can do it though. Don't worry, we'll pull through. Mike just needs to Mike just needs to climb ice better. How hard can it be? No yes! I'm just doing what comes naturally. How hot hard can it be? Played in third. Well I have to restart the whole game to play it in third. I can't. <laughs> I did it though. Don't worry about it. Now I know how the dinosaurs felt. That's true. They're still down there. What if there was an immortal dinosaur? And it's still in a tar pit somewhere. Oh no. That's sad. What do do? I'm ready. I'm ready for the button. Yeah, finally no more meteorites. Only took... It's like... Take a hint, you know? Social cues. I'm not interested. Keep your flaming balls to yourself. Alright. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Scanning area, and... Hole in one. All right, so far so good. Now we just go straight to the forest. Hey, look, my mark. It wasn't that far off, actually. Look at that. Pretty good at that. Uh, select, delete. So I need to go in here, and then we need to do the whole sneaky walk. Ooh. Wait, forest? Wait, no. Where? This way. Yes. Okay. Do 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 Oh yeah, it's that way. Okay. So I just want to get to the Master Sword. And then, I guess we could go and try to just go into Ganon and just see what he looks like. Because I just want to, I just want to look. I just want to take a peek, okay? Just a quick peek. Just a quick gander. Uh-oh. Don't! Kill me. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Nope. Here we go. This would be super cool in VR with all the particles. Just saying. <gasps> That's right. We have. Oh shit! But uh, Hestu is not gonna be here though because he's still waiting outside of uh, uh, Kakariko Village, isn't he? Because I didn't trigger him, so he's not gonna be here yet. It's nice. Nice place. Oh, what? It's right there. I'm not allowed to take shortcuts. Not in the forest. Dang it. He is the best boy. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, I know. I mean, we could go get him. We could just... We should. We could just go teleport back to uh, Kakariko and just go, go say hello to him. Just so we meet him at least. You gotta follow the sparkles. Follow the wind. The wind will guide you. Where'd you want me to go? That way. You got it, baby. Hestu is the best, dude. Ha <laughs> ha! Clever. I got it. I understood. 
Okay. So now, you look at the moats, and you see what, which directions are going, and you can follow them. So they're going forwards, 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 sell forwards. Because the wind will, winds guide you. See, now they're going to the right, so I go to the right. Follow the breath of the wild, exactly. Pocahontas told us all those years ago. Colors of the wind. It's not really the colors of the wind. It's more like the shit. Follow the shit in the breeze. But I guess that was the canned version of the song because it didn't sit well with, with Disney, maybe. I can paint with all the shit in the wind. It doesn't have the same ring to it. But hey, we did it! That's nice. Okay. I just wanna... I, I wish I could turn off... Wait, I can put on... System... Can I set it to... Pro... HUD mode. Pro. <gasps> so clean! Except for the hearts, but... So clean. You can't even see the hearts. They're behind my face. Oh yeah. So nice in here. Man, for sure. Th okay, so on the sw oh man, on the Switch version, this is where the performance is the worst because there's so much trees and, and light and stuff going on. It's still rock solid. I'm really impressed. Oh. Movie time. Yep, that's it. I mean, just this. As the visual, with the Master Sword right there. Wait. Ooh. Ah. Very nice. Very nice. Can I get like a closer picture of this? It's just the Master Sword? Photo mode. Let's pull it, shall we? Can I do it? I'm immortal. No? I'm not allowed? Pull. What? <laughs> Link. Yeah, what's up? Help us, Obi-Wan Kenobi. The fate of Hyrule rests with you. Thanks for the new wallpaper. Yeah, why'd you think I took a screenshot? Wait. I'm gonna I'm gonna see if I can. Who is that? Did I doze off again? Hmm. Well, well. It doesn't sound correct. It's you. You finally decided to return. Better late than never. After 100 years, I've nearly given up hope on seeing you again. Even Couldn't they get an actual old guy to do his voice? You know, now it's just a young man doing this like instead. Your face I'm me. old you for real. No of me, however. I have watched over Hyrule. Since time immemorial. Is this a fan dub? Many have referred to me over the ages Is this the actual voice? Deku tree. It doesn't sound like it. That is the weapon created by the ancient goddess. The sword that seals the darkness. Oh yeah. That only the chosen knight can wield oh, against you don't say. the calamity Ganon. That was pretty cool. Screenshot. Believe it or not. It was actually you who wielded that sword 100 years ago. But I must warn you to take extreme caution. You can't tell me what to do. I'm taking screenshots, the sword stands bitch. As a test to anyone who would dare attempt to possess it. Oh, yeah. That's pretty cool. As you are now, 
I cannot say now. <laughs> whether you are worthy or not. If you oh yeah, these guys! To free the sword in any sort of weaker state, you would surely lose your life where you stand. <laughs> you would surely lose your life where Best you stand. Luck, young one. At least do this. You would surely lose your life where you stand. Do not pull the... If you hope to pull the sword from its resting place, you must use your true strength. Let us see whether or not you are currently possessed power. Would have been better. They just needed a mixer, that's it. Yo, what's up? Look, I'm gonna pull it for sure. I'm gonna do it for real. Can't take away my hearts. I'm immortal. Oh. Bah. Curses. I can't do it. Alright. Fair enough. Yeah, yeah, I'll do it better next time. Don't worry about it. Bah. Shoot. Well, at least it's pretty. I still want a screenshot of, like, his face in the picture as well, with the sword, like that. I wish I could hide the hearts, but I could Photoshop them out. Perfect. See you later! No, I'm not. I'm gonna look around a little bit. This is gorgeous. This is, like... Even though I've been here before and I know what this looks like, this is like a whole new ball game. So gorgeous. The colors, the light. Boop, boop, boop. Do you have a? Oh, it's a bird. I thought it was a. I thought it was a Korok with a with panties on his head. And I was about to question things. Hmm? It looks very warm and inviting. Yeah. And I got clean feet! You're right, I forgot. I stepped in water. Wait, where's the shrine? Shrine? Ah. Alright, so we'll do this, and then... We should, we should go get he he uh, Hestu. Kerug Shrine. Mm. We'll teleport back to Kakariko from here. Or a frog. Alright, skip that. Do, do, do. Okay, I'm gonna bail and I'm gonna go to. No, Kakariko. Yes, please. So we'll go there, we'll get Hestu, and then we'll bail and we'll go straight to the castle and we'll just infiltrate and we'll just show up at Ganon naked with a stick. Because we can. Because I want to do that. <laughs> That'll be our final stand. What, it, what is... Man. Poor Zelda, though. If we show up and beat Ganon in, like, boxer briefs with his stick. Do you think... Don't you think that she's going to feel a little bit inadequate? I'd feel bad for her if I did that. Anyway. Yeah, naked with three hearts. Ah, uh, four. Dang it. Well, I could go sell one. Uh, let's see. Where am I? Yes. Wait, is this it? Where's he at? No, that's not it. Doo -doo. Doo -doo. See, where am I? Where is Hestu? He is not here. I mean, at least it would be something for the legends, right? People would, people would like to to sing those songs. You know that, like, how was who was it? Wasn't it Jamie Oliver? Was it Jamie Oliver who was the naked chef? I'll be the naked hero of time. I'll be fine. He'll be like, 
that moment in Shrek 1, where Shrek takes the helmet off, and Fiona sees that he's an ogre, but instead there's just, I just, I'm just naked the entire time anyway. Wait, no, this is not it. This is this place, dang it. I haven't been here, okay. It's a great conversation starter, that's true. Uh, okay, wait. Is it through there? No, that's where you come in from the start. Where is he? He's up somewhere. Hello, new clothes. I don't need them. I do. I kind of do. Forget where, where he is. Is he up here? He's around here somewhere, right? He's like on a ledge where you, where you, just when you get out of town somewhere. Mike doesn't, doesn't need, Mike's beyond clothing at this point. That's so cool. Can I? I kind of want to fly. No, no. Okay. We need to go though. We need to go get, we need to go get, get, get good old, good old Hestu first. Yeah, it was the other way, wasn't it? It was just further down. I thought I was, uh, I thought I was at the entrance to to the village. Uh, this place. I mean, we can get there by going up here as well. Oh shit! I should shoot that. Or take a picture. Oh. Uh, okay, so we go through here, right? Mike is a free spirit. You can't contain Mike. Hell nah. Mike does what Mike wants. Pokemon Snap. I should have, yeah. Pokemon Snap that shit. It's first side quest, really. I don't think I ever handed that in. Or did I? Wasn't there like one... This is totally a thing. Yeah. Yeah, ha -ha. I did find you. I came from your hometown. Hey, look! Four poo for Hestu! Uh, oops. Okay, bye. Ah, oh, there's more poo over there. Uh, I'm not gonna bother though. Not yet. Not now. Oops. Okay, we're gonna go. I kinda. See, I could beat Ganon, but it's gonna take way too long, and I think I'm gonna get bored. So I probably won't. But I wanna go try. I wanna go just see what happens. But first, we need to find a big man who's lost his maracas. It's gonna be around the corner. Right there. There he is! Oh, a big lug of a guy. Whee! Whoop! Whoa! He's huge. I barely reach his belly button. Hello! Shalaka! Indeed. Yeah, I'm here. I can see you. I can see. I can see! Alright, I'll go get your... It's been a hundred years since anyone was able to see you. Man, it's gonna get real boring. Why are you out here? If no one... Well, maybe he's looking for someone who can see him. Uh, I'll get your... The priceless miracles. Don't worry about it. Yeah. <laughs> are the... I think he's, he's doing the thing that... What is it? The dad from Cloudy with a Chance of Meatballs? Where he doesn't have eyes, he just has the eyebrows. Hey, fellas! Guess who? Oh, it's your reckoning. That's who. Whoa, bam! Whoa, 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 whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! Smack all of them! Smack everybody! You can't die! Just kick ass! Wait, can I do like a... Am I, am I able to do the spinny attack? Woo! No! Wait, he does it too! Copy. Copycat. What are you, some sort of YouTuber or something? Bam! Bam, 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 bam! <gasps> Shit. That's great. Mike. It's kinda... I don't know. 
It's I wouldn't play the game immortally if I were to play it again. I'm just doing this for this for now, so that we don't have to deal with you dying. Because it, it kind of ruins it, doesn't it? But at the same time, it's my. No one can stop me. Stop! I just said no one can stop him. Oh, you look really pretty though. With the depth of field and the lighting. Very cool. If you could stop doing that particular attack, that would be great. Wait. Uh, no. I wanna do this? Hello? Mike? No! Don't throw your sword! Okay, wait. Pick that back up. I wanna do this. This. Not quite. Not quite what I had planned. Okay, here we go. Throw! Where? Where did... What? Okay, this whole throwing system of not throwing where you're looking... It doesn't really work, does it? Let's just kill him the normal way. Mike is very small, yeah. Everything is taller than Mike. Everyone. Mike is a tiny little baby. Hey, little baby boy. But he can't die. No one suspects Mike. Mike's immortality. Hestus Maracas. Easy. Didn't even lose a single health point. No problem. I'm gonna take all their guts, all their stuff. Gimme, 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 gimme. And I'm out. Easy. He's small and immortal. Just like the legends foretold. Wait, do I have a shield? Yes. Uh, shield? And then jump and... No. Jump and... Jump and... Jump and that. Yeah. Hester, what's up? Yo! Bam! Right in your belly. Don't ignore me. Talk to me. Shalakala. <sighs> well, we did something. We accomplished... Here you go. Take my ass. Oh, we get the dance, though. There's something wrong. Oh, wait. The Korok seeds inside his mur... Does he fill his maracas with poo? Because he puts them in the maracas, and it's poop. Well, anyway, let's give him some. Yeah, I have some. Yeah, 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 let's put them in. There you go. Um, I want a bigger everything. That'd be great. Weapon stash, please. Well, it's poop, and he puts the poop in the maracas. Nice. Thank you. <laughs> da na 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 na. All right, let's just do that four more times. Yep, 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 yep. I still smell Korok seeds on you. Gross. A shield, please. Bam. Nice. Thank you. Another shield stash. Da na 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 na. All right, and I'll get a bow as well. Your shield stash has been expanded. Shalaka! Look at the time. Oh no! He's peacing out! Back to the forest. Yeah, alright. I'll come back later. See ya! Da na 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 na. Okay. Can I teleport anywhere close to the castle? I guess this is probably the best we can do. Well, maybe this one. <laughs> Yeah, there's the different colors for different expansions, I guess. Nice. All right. Now we go to the castle. That's the last mission we have for the day. It's going to be a little bit of a trek, but we can do it. Maybe. Where's the castle? Uh, ah, all right. Not too bad. All right, here we go. Towards Ganon. Can we beat the game? Without 
I've never gone to the castle without completing any of the guardians, so it's gonna be a tricky one. I have horse door. Well, yeah, that means I have to go to a stables though, and also I can't just fly like this, which I prefer. It's nice being able to fly infinitely, actually. I think if I were to play this game again, I would probably keep infinite stamina on, just for the ease of things, and never-ending Rivali's Gale. It's nice, though. Who sees me? Oh. Awkward. Don't do it! <laughs> no! Okay, this is gonna be a little bit tricky. Wait. I kinda wanna look at you. Okay, you're kinda badass. Come back! Don't kill me though. Don't do it. Don't! Oh no. Okay, bail. Bail, Mike. Mike, 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 Don't fall over all the time! See, this is what I was worried about. Because I'm gonna just fall over a lot. And not be able to walk. Wait, I can do this! Haha! -ha. See ya. The fire makes an updraft. We can just bail. Yeah, they're a little bit spooky. Especially if you could die. Stop! Oh. Lucky thing that my glider that's made out of wooden cloth can't burn. Stop! Jesus. Oh, wait. Go, go, go. Go, Mike. Mike, Mike. Go, right. Fly. Fly the wind. Ride the wind, bullseye. Dang it. Do you ever give up? Okay, we're fine. Ah, no problems, right? Just according to plan. <laughs> it's hard to know when I'm falling over or not. The only thing I have to base that off of is when my buttons don't do anything anymore. Then I know that I've fallen. Oh. I did it! I got to the castle. No, no, I didn't die. It's just a little cutscene. We gotta know. We gotta know that Zelda's in there, winking at us. Oh, no, we're good. I thought we were stuck in perpetual loading land, but we made it. We don't have a legendary mop. No, that's true. We just have a stick, I guess. We could do that. I'm curious how much damage that's gonna do. If I can even damage him at all with it. It's really dark. Hello? I can't see nothing. Oh, that, okay, that was a, a water. Dang. Hello? Jesus. It's very confusing. I wish... Okay, I think there's something here with uh, the lighting. I don't think it's this dark in the original game. There's probably something to do with the nightlight. Nightlight! Nightlight! Alright, we'll manage. Death by a thousand paper cuts. Yeah, kind of. Thousand stick pokes. Alright, we made it. We made it up. Where are we? Where am I? Where's the Ooh. No no! No no! Uh-oh. Bail 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 bail! <laughs> Just in time. Don't. Don't! 
Is it a pointy stick? No, it's basically just a branch that I... No, I was so close. It's literally just a branch that I broke off a tree, but you know. Damn it. Just let me climb. Let me go around this. <gasps> no! See, this is, the, this is the hardest part with getting to the castle. At least we can do this. Maybe we should just go around the back. Oh, shit. Hello. Hey, I can see stuff. I can see. Uh, okay, this looks like a good place to climb. Ah! Perfect. Yeah, if we can't get to him at all. I mean, we can. It's just going to be a little bit tricky. There's a lot of bumps in the road. Uh, let's go. Wait, is this a Zelda's tower? Did I accidentally my way to Zelda's tower? Hey, Mike, listen. What are you doing? What are you doing there, buddy? Oh, no, it isn't. Okay. Whoa! Duh! Okay, wait. Uh, tower, 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 goo, 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 okay. Ooh. Wait, there's a hole there? You can just go in the window? Where am I? Let's go this way. Can I just stealth stealth kill Ganon from, from behind? Look, there he is! He's sitting in there! That's them! That's the sack! The Ganon sack! Wait, I'm above him. Oh. Wait, no. Where's the door? I'm so lost. Yeah, it's the Ganon sack. It was just sitting there. Where's the front door? All right, we'll find it. Don't worry about it. We'll just go around. We'll snoop a bit. No, no. I guess I could do this. Where am I? Uh Oh, I'm on the complete opposite side. Wait, couldn't I just go through here? Or is this going to lock me in, like, a battle of the ages? Wait, he's in here! There he is! Cannon sack! Right there! <laughs> Mark. Hello? Oh shit, you have to fight all of them here now? Oh, because I didn't fight them at the beasts. They're all here. Oh, interesting. So these are all the... the guardians. Huh. Yeah, I've never... I've never gone... Uh, to the castle without beating... beating them, obviously. Because that's... Uh, game. Wait, what are you doing? What if I shoot you like this? Does that do any damage? Oh shit, look! Took like two pixels of health! Wow! I'm amazing! Alright, so the game wants me to do that with four of them, plus then Ganon. Wait, I can't leave. I can't leave, but I'm immortal! Uh-oh. Wait, I have a fix. Nailed it. Wait! I have fairies! Aw, oh, dang it. Sorry, fairies. <laughs> the fairies, they saved me. Yeah. Give myself the super weapon. I can't. 
Well, I, I can give myself weapons. I mean, well, the weapons I do have, they don't... They don't break, but... Hey, you can actually fight him like this. <laughs> it's a little bit awkward. I can barely see what's happening, but, you know, it works. Alright, just kill me. Kill me! Stop trying to hit me and hit me! Bam! Fairies, why? Why did I pick up so many fairies? Kill me! Kill me! Shoot me more! No, no, shoot, sorry, shoot me! That works also. I can't... Oh, no, I can't die. I turned off the infinite hearts. Kill me! Dang it, I had another fairy. That's the last fairy, though. Kill me. Kill me. Kill me! I want out! I want out of this... No! I just want out of this fight. Alright, here you go. Come back. Come back. Come back. Here you go. Now kill me. Shoot me. Shoot me. Shoot me. Smack me. Suck it. One more hit. I think. And then we're free. Dang it. Free! Set me free! Sweet embrace of death! I just want Mike to be free. Free from this burden. Hello. Okay, now. There he goes. <laughs> Aww. Sad. Well, there it goes. There it goes. There goes poor Mike. All right. Well, anyway, ugh, that was a look at Zelda on the PC at, wait, let me just teleport. Leave the area. Zelda emulated on the PC at 1440p in this case at I'm going to estimate 40, 50 frames per second most of the time. I don't think we ever actually stayed at 60 a lot of the time. Maybe for some of the easier sections, but... I think we've kept over 30 for most of the time. By my... As far as I can judge for myself, anyway. Which is pretty impressive. Uh, because, well, it's not a PC game. It's emulated. And there's a lot of... <laughs> was that a little fart? There's a lot of effects in this game. I'm pretty cool with, with, with how this is running. I'm very impressed. Uh, the first person mod, it is fun. I like, I've, 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 I've enjoyed seeing things from a different perspective. It puts a neat spin on the game. I do think that it would be kind of obnoxious to play the whole game like that, but... For screenshots and for little adventures like this, pretty fun. I've enjoyed it. It was nice to be back in the world for a little bit. So I hope you enjoyed it also. Uh, if you do have a Switch and you don't have this game, I would highly, highly, highly recommend buying it. This one and Mario Odyssey are my two favorite games on the Switch and very highly ranked as far as games in general go. So enjoy your own adventures if you do. For now, I'm going to call the stream here for tonight. So let's put on some music. And thanks, Jet. So let's see, save as well. Blee Purple 125 bonus 12. Thanks for the fun stream, Robin. It was great seeing Mike again. <laughs> thanks, Carrie Berry. It was, wasn't it? Return to title screen. <sighs> I still haven't ever tried the motorcycle myself. Maybe I should do that. But for now, that is the end of Mike and his uh, perspective on the world. Let's see, let's put the music back on because it's so quiet out here. Um, boop. Wait, Hateno Village. Oh, what a good one to go out on. All right, well, I'm gonna go. But I'm going to say thank you for hanging around and for the bits and the follows and the resubs and subs and all that. And uh, I'm going to roll the credits. Let's see, should we raid someone today? Who's doing things today? Bob is on, Gab is on. 
Oh, Sean is on. Twitch presents on. Duh. That's about it. Where are they playing? Sekiro and Sekiro. Of course. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. Oh, it's a good song, isn't it? All right. Uh, let's see. We'll do... I need my keyboard. Uh. <sighs> Don't worry. Mike is never really gone. That is true. Uh, raid. We'll do a raid, and I'm going to roll the credits. But I hope you've enjoyed this look back at a modded version of Zelda. And I'll see you next time for something else. For now, farewell.